Ugh, man, man, you it's good that we're finally gonna fix our sleep schedule by going to bed nice and early. We've been needing that for a while now. Yeah, staying up till 2am every night was pretty fun, but we can't afford to do it anymore. It's not fun to wake up at noon. Yep, you said it, Manuel. Anyways, can you go turn off the light, please? Alright, I got it. Alright, and off. I love being extra for no reason. <laughs> so, Luigi, you ready to finally wake up before everybody else? Oh, yeah, man, that's gonna be awesome, but, uh, I don't really know if I'm ready to go to sleep yet, though. I mean, what if the boogeyman tries to get me? The boogeyman? Well, yeah, I mean, what if he breaks in here while we're sleeping and he tries to steal my socks? Luigi, that's stupid. Go to sleep. Well, I'm just saying... <sighs> you know what? Never mind, Medya. But when the boogeyman gets you, don't come crying to me. I'm just gonna get some sleep. <sighs> Getting some breakfast. Whoa! Oh, 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 oh my god! <laughs> what the heck? What was that? Was that the boogeyman? You know what? No, never mind. It's not the boogeyman. I'm just saying stupid stuff. I guess Matthew was right. Ha, ah, good morning, Maddie. Maddie? Maddie? Where'd he go? I thought he was next to me. <gasps> Wait a minute. He must have woken up before me. Aw, oh, man, I wanted to wake up before him. But I guess I'll get him someday. I'm just gonna go make me some breakfast so I can start the day off right. <laughs> oh, hey, Matthew, there you are. Uh, I don't know why you're sleeping on the floor, but... <gasps> Wait a minute. This means that I technically did wake up first because he's still asleep and I'm not. Oh, yes, this is another victory for Luigi. Oh, yeah, now that I have another win to my name, I'm just gonna make me some nice breakfast. <laughs> breakfast for the champ. Ugh, man, that was a good breakfast. Had I time to go back upstairs? Oh, I got so many things planned for today. Uh, huh? Hmm, you know, now that I think about it, something about this isn't normal. I mean, I'm a heavy sleeper, but I've never seen it to this extent. Madio? Madio? Why isn't he waking up? Hello? Uh, something must be wrong. I have to go ask others about this. Come with me, Madio. Uh, hey Bowser, can you help me out with something? Are you sure, Luigi? What's up? Aw, oh, come on, Luigi. I wanted to be the one that killed Mario. Bowser, I didn't kill Mario, but I can't seem to figure out why he won't wake up. Are you sure he's not dead? Well, no, no, no. He's not dead, Bowser. Don't say that. It's just I've tried everything to get him to wake up. I mean, I've tried yelling his name and moving him around, and he just won't budge. Hmm. Why don't you just try hitting him to death till he wakes up? Well, Bowser, how is that supposed to help? Why would I hit Mario? I don't know. That's the only idea I have. I guess thanks for the advice, Bowser. Well, of course, Luigi can always count on me. Oh, I can't wait to see what my controller will look like once I color it green. Oh, it's gonna look so cool. Uh, Junior, I need your help with some... What are you doing? Huh? Oh, hey, Luigi, I'm just trying to give my controller a fresh new skin. Do you think it'll look good in the color green? Uh, Junior, I hope you know that that's not how you do that. But anyways, Junior, can you help with Madio? He won't answer anything I say no matter how much I try. Hmm, I don't know. He looks pretty dead to me. Well, no, he's not dead, Junior. Don't say that. I just can't seem to figure out why he won't react to literally anything. Hey, Madio! Mario, hello? You see what I mean? Hmm, yes I do admit, this is quite a peculiar case, but I think I have the solution to all this. Luigi, he's probably just in a deep sleep, you're overthinking this. A deep sleep? Well, no, Junior, there's no way! Trust me, me and Mario are known for being deep sleepers, but there's always something that makes us wake up. Yeah, I guess that's true. Well, I don't know, just try playing a song he really hates or something, that would make me wake up for sure. <gasps> Good thinking, Junior, use that as a backup plan. Thanks for the advice. Oh god, I need more advice than that, where am I gonna get more advice? Oh, wait, why would you need more advice? I just gave you some- Alright then, have fun making things more complicated. Oh man, I don't have any good advice. Who am I supposed to ask? <gasps> Yoshi. I can ask Yoshi for advice. <laughs> okay, Yoshi, I really need your help, okay? For some reason, Mario just won't wake up, and I don't know why, okay? Do you know what's going on? Luigi's dead. What, dead? Why does everyone keep saying that? There's no way Mario can be dead. Yeah, now that you say that, Yoshi, that makes a lot more sense. That's exactly what I was trying to tell you. Uh, no, you guys are all wrong. I'll prove it. We'll take Mario to the hospital, and there we'll find out if he's dead, okay? Now let's get in the car.
So, Doctor, what's going on? Well, you see, the good side of things is that since Mario obviously has a pulse, we know that he's still alive. Yes, I know it! See, guys, I told you Mario wasn't dead! I told you so! Hey, you can't blame us for making assumptions! I mean, he looked just like Dad's grandpa when he was laying in that casket. Junior, what made you think that was appropriate to say? Wait, so what does this mean for Mario then? Well, let's see. He has a pulse, but he doesn't show much brain activity, and he can't move, so he might be in a deep coma of some sort. <gasps> Wait, what? Yeah, I was kind of expecting that. So, is there anything we can do? Like, is there a way to snap him out? Well, unfortunately, there isn't much we can do besides just wait for him to wake up, which could be at any time. I mean, it could be now or 50 years down the line. You never really know. Like it with 50 years without my brother! Manuel, if you can hear me so Somewhere in there, please keep fighting, bro. I know you can do this. Do this. Do this. Hello? Uh, hello? Uh, what's going on? This is really weird. What am I doing at the hospital with all my friends? Luigi, Junior, Yoshi, Bowser, they're all here, but why? <gasps> Wait a minute. Maybe they're throwing me a surprise birthday party. Wait, my birthday isn't until May. Hey, I know you guys can hear me. Hello? Ugh, screw this. I'm just gonna go get a Twinkie. Wait, what? Why can't I move? What the heck is going on? Huh? Hey guys, I'm getting some brain activity from Mario. Wait, really? Well, that's good. Well, what are we supposed to do now? I mean, you're free to take him home. Just make sure to watch after him and feed him well. That's all I suggest. He should be fine. Huh, well, okay. Come on, Mario. Wait, why are you dragging me? Let me go! Uh, hello? Can you guys actually not hear me? I mean, I can see and hear you guys. Alright guys, now that we got Maddio tucked in the bed, you think it's time to get some Shed-Eye? Luigi, do you actually not remember that time that you yourself had a coma? Why are you so worried about Mario? Well, because, Junior, who knows when he's gonna wake up? Wait, wake up? What do you mean, wake up? I'm right here! I mean, you woke up from your coma within less than 24 hours, so who's to say Mario can't either? Huh, I guess that could be true. What the hell are you guys talking about? Alright guys, you ready to get some sleep? It's been a really stressful day. Yeah, we just gotta wish for the best in the morning. Alright, let's go guys. Good night, Luigi. Alright, good night guys. Sleep tight. Alright, man, you'll see you tomorrow morning. Hopefully you'll be okay. Wh what? Good night, brother. Uh, so, I guess I'm actually in a coma? And not even one of those good comas where you get to sleep forever? Oh man, this is gonna be so boring. I can see and hear everything, but I can't do anything. This sucks. Well, at least this made me realize one thing. This is gonna be a lot harder than I thought. <laughs> what the heck is that? Oh, it's just Maddio's stupid alarm. <gasps> Wait a minute! Maddio! Oh, I gotta go check on him. I gotta see if he's woken up. Yeah. Oh, man, that was a pretty good sleep. You know, I'm starting to kind of like this whole coma thing. You know, I can just sit back, relax for as long as I want, nobody to bother me. Hey, Maddio! Maddio! How you doing? <sighs> Never mind. Uh, hey, Maddio, how you doing? I came as soon as I woke up. M Maddio? Oh, man, you're still not awake. I thought you would have been out of that coma by now. It's been over a day. Oh, what am I supposed to do? I mean, there's not really anything you can do. You kind of just have to wait for me to wake up or something. <gasps> oh, I know. I just got to spend as much time as I possibly can with you. And since we have such a good brotherly bond, maybe it'll cause you to snap out of your coma. L Luigi, I don't think that's how science works. Ugh, how that, man? Yo, how am I to think of something we can do? Hmm. Please be the TV, please be the TV, please be the TV! <gasps> I know! How about I tell you my whole life story from start to finish, every single detail? Okay, I doubt that you actually remember your whole life story with every detail, but no, Luigi, that's gonna take forever! That's gonna take, like, hours, probably days! I'm gonna take that silence as a yes. Alright, so it all started years back at the hospital. Our parents were there, and so were the doctors. Uh, oh my god, he's actually doing it! I thought he wasn't gonna do it! <sighs> oh well, I mean, this isn't really gonna be that interesting, but... It shouldn't take too long. And then you got in that coma, and that's where the story ends. Or well, at least where it's supposed to continue. I can't predict the future, so I can't say anything about that. So, Maddio, what did you think? Pretty cool story, huh? Yeah, emphasis on the word story. Luigi, you literally made up most of that. Like, how does it make sense that you were the Prime Minister of England when we live in America? Alright, well, until I come up with the next thing we can do, I'm just gonna go downstairs and make me some lunch. Or probably dinner, I don't know. That story took up, like, all afternoon. God, I can't believe how long that story was. Oh, great. Luigi mentioned lunch, and now I'm hungry. How am I even supposed to eat during a coma? Oh, be quiet, stomach. I'm going to the kitchen to get some food, okay? Be patient. Hey, be quiet, stomach, okay? 
Wait a minute, that wasn't my stomach that time. <gasps> Wait a minute! Uh, oh my god, but Matthew, that's you! Oh, I can't believe it. He hasn't eaten food in over a day. Well, don't worry, Matthew. I'll go get you some food from the kitchen, okay? Uh, oh, well, wow, Luigi's actually getting me food? Oh, well, that's nice. I guess that makes up for the eight-hour-long story. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got in the fridge. Ugh. All right, let's see. Mm. <gasps> a chicken tender! Oh, Matthew's gonna love this. He loves chicken tenders. Hi, right, Matthew. Here is your specially prepared chicken tender. I hope you enjoy. And now it's time to go make my food. I swear his IQ drops by the minute. Hmm. Hi, right, I wonder what I'm gonna eat today. I guess I could order some Subway, but I don't know how much money I have on me. <sighs> God, I gotta stop waking up late. Well, oh, hey, Luigi, what are you doing? <gasps> oh, good morning, Junior. Or good afternoon. I'm just going downstairs to make some food. Do you want some? Oh, sure, I'll take some food. Thanks for the offer, Luigi. Alrighty, I'll go get started on it right now. Sweet, oh, this is gonna be awesome. I'll just go watch some TV while I wait. <laughs> well, oh, hey, Mario, I didn't expect to see you here. And, uh, chicken tender? Uh, what is this chicken tender doing here? I mean, it's not mine. It's definitely not yours, so... Wait a minute, it's probably Luigi's. I should go ask him about this. Uh, hey, Luigi, I think you left the chicken tender on the bed. Are you sure that's not part of the food you're making? Uh, no, we don't have any more chicken tenders. I just made the last one for- <gasps> Oh, you're thinking of Matthew's chicken tender. Oh, yeah, don't touch that. I made that for him. You mean the guy who literally can't move? What? <gasps> oh, yeah, I forgot. He can't eat on his own. Man, this is gonna take a lot of adjusting to do. Thanks for reminding me, Junior. I'll go fix that right now. Uh, all right, you're welcome, Luigi. Well, I guess I'm gonna go make my own food then. Uh, all right, Matthew. So I probably should have realized that you can't eat on your own, so sorry about that. That was my bad. But how am I supposed to get you to eat? I mean, I can't just let you sit there and eat nothing. What do I do? <gasps> Wait. I don't know if this will work, but it's worth a shot. Wh what? All right, man, you have got the solution to all of our problems, so here you go. W what? What is this guy even trying to do? Uh, I hope this is working. I don't know how long I have to stand here for, though. Hey, Luigi, what's the Wi-Fi password? I think Bowser changed it. W uh, Luigi, what are you doing? Oh, hey, Yoshi, I'm just trying to feed Matthew. He's really hungry. And how exactly are you doing that? Oh, well, I'm just using this piece of paper. This one's got a cheeseburger on it, so I know he's loving this. It's his favorite food. Okay, I'll ask my question again. How exactly is this feeding him? What do you mean? It's just feeding him. Didn't you pay attention in science class? Wh what? Luigi, what does science class have to do with this? Oh my gosh, Yoshi, you really forgot about photosynthesis? You're so silly. You're trying to use photosynthesis on a person? But yeah, why? I mean, it works with plants. Why wouldn't it work for him? <sighs> Luigi, I'm not even going to explain why this is stupid. I'm just going to leave before my brain rots. I'll see you later. Okay, then. Bye, Yoshi. Man, why was he being so weird? Oh, hold on, Matthew, the phone's ringing. A uh, call from the hospital? What do they need? Eh, maybe it's important. Maybe it's about Matthew. All right, uh, hello? Whoa, uh, hey, Luigi. So, basically, the reason I'm calling is because we kind of made a really big mistake. We forgot to give you the necessary materials to feed Mario. Oh, no, no, that's okay. I'm figuring out ways to feed him right now using photosynthesis. My friends aren't very supportive of it, though. Uh, yeah, I can see why. Anyways, no, that's not how you feed him. See, you're supposed to use an IV tube connected to a machine, which will transfer nutrients into his body. Uh, I don't know what any of that means. <sighs> the IV tube is what feeds him. We need to deliver it to your house. We're just letting you know in advance so it doesn't come off as a surprise. Wait, my ID feeds him? Sir, I barely even used my ID. I got it so long ago. Why would that thing feed him? W what the? <sighs> no, I said IV. You know what? It'll be delivered to your house tomorrow. It'll come with instructions so your hollow brain will know what to do with it. Wait, but I already have my ID. Why are you giving me another one? You're a moron. W what? <laughs> Hello? Oh man, he hung up on me. But he said something about delivering something to the house, so I guess I have to wait till that thing delivers. Hope it won't be too long. Huh? Who's at the door? <sighs> Hello? Hello? Who's at the door? Oh, there's a box here. Wait, what does it say? Sorry, we couldn't find a spare IV tube, but this device will still feed him. Okay, if you say so. Hmm, I wonder what's in this box. Let's see. Yeah. What the heck is this thing? Like, like, how does it even work? I don't get it. Wait a minute, maybe that part's supposed to go around the space. Alright, Matthew, I guess it's time to feed you. Alright, I think I've got it all set up now. Now, all I have to do is just press this button. Wow, the thing just fed him like that? This thing's pretty cool. Well, Matthew, I hope you enjoyed your meal. I'm just gonna go to the bathroom really quick. And the three little pigs lived happily ever after. The end. W what? Matthew! Matthew, where'd you go? I thought we were playing hide and seek. Oh, you're so good at this game. Hey, Matthew, catch! Ah. 
Oh, thank God that didn't hit me. Why didn't you catch it? Hey, Matthew, look at this. So the packaging gets some really weird bubble wrap in it. But you know what we do to bubble wrap. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I don't know how much longer I can take this. <laughs> I mean, at first I thought it'd be okay, you know? I get to see my brother every day, but I just hate seeing someone who was so filled with life be restricted to this. Oh my god, somewhere in there, Matthew's just begging to come out. I'd do anything just to get my brother back. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. But how? <gasps> oh, I know. I just gotta call the doctor and see if he has any advice. I mean, he's the one that knows a lot about coma, so maybe he knows. Alright, you just gotta hope he answers. Don't worry, man. I'll get you out of this. Uh, huh? A call from Luigi? Let's see what it is. Uh, hello, this is your doctor speaking. Oh, hey, doctor. So basically, it's been a couple weeks since Maggio first went into his coma, and he still hasn't woken up, but I'm getting really sick of it. So do you have any advice on how to wake him up? W wow, I didn't know Luigi wanted me out of the coma this much. I mean, I want to be out of it too, but jeez, I really got to try something. He's going to go crazy. So what should I do? Mm. <gasps> oh, I know. I just got to see if I can force myself to move. <sighs> God, it's so hard to do. Wait, I just kind of felt a muscle, though. <gasps> Wait, I think I have some feeling. Uh, well, I was thinking you should try some Adderall. I don't know. I've never used it before. <sighs> oh, my God. I'm uh, moving a little bit. Uh, 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 <sighs> the heck was that? Oh my god! Uh, hey, doctor, I'm gonna have to call you back later. Oh my god, Matthew! Oh my god, Matthew! Are you okay? How did you fall? Wait a minute, you couldn't have fell. You weren't that close to the end of the bed. So that means... Oh my god! He just fell on his own! He fell on purpose! Oh my god, that means there's still some life in him! I have to get the others! <sighs> Jeez, I took up all my energy. Well, I hope Luigi finds some kind of a solution. Okay, guys, now I know it's gonna sound strange, but I need you to hear me out, okay? So while I was at a phone call, Matteo, who wasn't even close to the edge of the bed, somehow found himself on the floor. I mean, someone who's basically paralyzed shouldn't fall off a bed, right? Yeah, I mean, he was sitting pretty close to the edge of the bed. It could have happened naturally. Yeah, but he wasn't that close, so maybe it could mean something. Something a lot deeper than we thought. Have any of you guys seen my Game Boy? I lost it last week. Look, guys, if I'm being completely honest, it kind of seems like a sign of Maggio wanting to break free, and we gotta be the ones to help him with that. So how are we gonna do it? Do you guys have any ideas? Mm, no, not off the top of my head. Yeah, I feel like we've already tried a lot of ideas. It's gonna be hard to come up with something original. Hmm, okay. Bowser, do you have any ideas? I mean, does he know where my Game Boy is? <sighs> Never mind. <gasps> Wait a minute, I just came up with something. All right, Maggio, you're coming to the stairs. Wait, what? Why are you going to the stairs, Luigi? What are you doing? All right, Maggio, are you ready for takeoff? N no, not really. This seems like a terrible idea. Uh, Luigi, I don't think this is a very smart idea on how to get Mario out of his coma. I mean, usually this is how people go into comas, not out of them. But wait, really? Oh, yeah, I guess I can see why. Well, what am I supposed to do then? I mean, I have a few ideas. <laughs> Well, guys, it looks like none of those things worked. I don't know what we're gonna do to get Maddio out of this. Well, wait a minute. I just realized we haven't done the most obvious solution. Why don't we just play a bunch of loud sounds into his ear and see if that does anything? Hmm. You know, I guess that could be worth a shot. W what? No, it's not. It's just gonna irritate me a bunch, and there's nothing I can do about it. Well, I guess it's time to play some sounds, so I'll go first. All right, let's hope this works. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? Nothing? Nothing at all? All right, Bowser, I guess you try to play a loud sound. Okay, this one has to work. Ugh. Oh, come on, Mario, you're still not waking up. This is the most annoying thing ever. Hmm, let me see. I think I have an idea. All right, let me just press play. Oh, this one is so funny. Mario, how are you not laughing at this? It's so fun. <laughs> Seriously? How is this not working? Guys, I don't think this is working. I think we just gotta give up on this plan. But what are we gonna do? 
Wait a minute, speaking of sounds... I don't know, just try playing a song he really hates or something. That would make me wake up for sure. Junior, give me the phone. I have one more sound that we can play. Alright, guys, if this doesn't work, then I don't know what will. Alright, let me just press play. <laughs> oh my god! Jesus, what was that? Wait, but Matthew, are you back? Uh, yeah, I guess so. I mean, my legs can move, my arms can move, I guess I'm good to go. Wait, how did that happen with that song? I don't know, I guess my cringe levels just raised so high that my body couldn't take it. Well, anyways, at least I'm back. Huh, well, that's cool. Alright, we're gonna go to bed, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Alright, see you guys! Well, Matthew, now that you're finally back, what's the first thing that we should do? Eh, I don't know. I say we just sleep it off and figure it out in the morning. S -s sleep it off? Uh, Matthew, are you sure? I mean, what if the boogeyman comes in? Ugh, man, there's so much trash in our backyard. We've really got to hire someone to clean this place up. Oh, hey, Mr. B, what are you doing? Uh, okay then, you don't have to answer. Why am I talking to a bee anyway? It's really weird. I'm just gonna get back to cleaning up the trash. Ugh, get out of my face, Mr. B! Okay, look, look, look. I'm gonna give you one more chance to get out of my face, okay? Uh, get out of my face! Ah! Oh, shoot. I just swatted a bee, didn't I? Ah! Oh, my God! God, that really hurt! Oh, he stung me on the nose, you stupid bee! Oh, I gotta go back inside now, this really hurts. Uh, ow! Ow! Oh, my God, it hurts so bad! What do I do? Uh, hey, man, yo, what happened to you? Uh, I got stung! By a bee stung me right on my nose and it hurts really badly <laughs> yeah i also got a bee on my science test not to brag or anything wait you got stung by a bee man yo that's not good don't you know how serious bee stings are no it's never really happened to me before what do bee stings do well from what i remember they make your skin start to swell up and itch so i probably get your hands off your face oh okay so is there anything i could do is there a cure to this well sadly not that i know of god why does school not teach us stuff like this i mean i know what bee stings do but i don't know how to fix them what is the education system doing to us? Yeah, I can safely say that that science test I took today had nothing to do with bees. Outside of my grade! Junior, I can assure you literally no one cares about your grade. But guys, do you think I'm gonna be okay? Am I gonna die from this? No, you're not gonna die, man. You should probably just stay inside for a while till you get better. Yeah, you should probably- Junior, if this is about your science test, then I don't want to hear it. Uh, no. I was gonna say that Luigi's actually right, and you should probably try getting as much rest as you possibly can. Uh, oh, well, thanks for the advice, guys. Uh, hopefully this pain goes away soon. Junior, I'm really worried for him. Do you think he'll be okay? Yes, Luigi, he'll be fine. Just don't worry about it. He's an adult. He can manage himself. He'll go rest on his own. Uh, okay, whatever you say, Junior. I just really hope he'll be okay. I mean, I've never had a bee sting before, so hopefully everything will be all right. Ow! Ow! Oh my god, my skin just hurts so much! God, I want to itch it so badly! But like Luigi said, I just have to try not to touch it so it heals faster. God, it itches so much, though! Oh well, hopefully in the morning we get to figure something out. Maybe getting some rest will help. Alright, good night! <laughs> Madio? Are you okay? Uh, Madio! Madio? Where is he? Uh, Luigi, I don't think you want to see me right now. I mean, yeah, I don't really want to see you either. But, but Madio, you screamed! I have to see what's going on! What? Uh, uh, Madio? Is that you? Uh, oh my gosh, but Madio, what the heck happened to you? Why do you look like that? I don't know, I mean, I was just sleeping, and then I woke up, and I felt really weird, so I decided to go look in the mirror, and now I'm a bee! I don't even know how this happened! Mm, what's going on in here? Why are you guys so loud? I was trying to dream about the Switch Pro coming out. Oh, sorry, Junior, that sounds like a really good dream. I mean, I want the Switch Pro as well, but personally, I don't believe that they'll ever make it. <laughs> You guys get it? Shut up, Madio. Anyways, Junior, for some reason, Madio turned into a bee, and we can't seem to figure out why. I mean, didn't he just get stung by a bee yesterday? Doesn't that have some kind of weird correlation? Okay, but I don't think getting stung by a bee literally turns you into one. I mean, if a dog bites you, are you gonna turn into a dog? That's stupid. What's going on in here? What? Oh my god, Mario, are you serious? It's too early for Halloween. What are you doing? Uh, actually, isn't he technically late for Halloween? What do you mean? I mean, technically, last Halloween was five months ago, and the next Halloween isn't until seven months, so he's technically late because there's a shorter amount of time between... <sighs> that was stupid. Anyways, Mario, how do you think this happened? Like I said, I have no idea how this happened. I mean, I just went to sleep, and then I woke up looking like this. God, I wish this was a costume, and even if it is, then it's impossible to take off. It's like super glued on to me. 
I guess I'm just gonna have to live the rest of my life as a bee then. Well, no, no, Medio, don't give up that easily. I'm sure we can figure something out. Like, maybe we can call the doctors and see if they know anything. But would you really think it's an everyday occurrence that a human just magically turns into a bee overnight? Come on, be realistic. I just have to adjust to my new life. Well, no, Medio, come on. Oh, man, I feel really bad for him. He sounded really devastated. But hopefully he doesn't find out about all the cool stuff you can do as a bee. I don't want him abusing his power. <sighs> Man, this sucks. I mean, what am I even supposed to do as a bee? I don't even like bees. And now I am one. I guess this is my karma for swatting that bee yesterday. But seriously though, what am I even supposed to do? Like, bees don't do anything cool. It's not like they can fly or anything. <clears throat> Wait a minute. I'm flying! Wait, I can fly over here? Or I can fly over here? Oh my god, wait, this is actually really cool! Oh, I gotta go show this to the guys! Hooey! Oh, guys! You wanna see something crazy right now? See, look, I can actually fly! See, I can fly over here, or I can fly over here! Oh my god, this is so cool! Oh no, Jerry, you actually found something cool to do as a bee! Knock it off, Matteo! Oh, and why is that, Luigi? Are you jealous? Are you jealous that I have these wings and you don't? Well, guess what, Luigi? They're my wings, and I'm gonna do whatever I want with them! Well, no, I'm not jealous, Matteo! I mean, it's cool that you can fly, but that's a lot of power that I don't think you should have. Hey, Mario, do some tricks. I mean, the show we're watching is kind of boring anyway, so can you put on a show for us? Whoa, you want to see some tricks, Junior? I'll show you some tricks. All right, what tricks can I actually do? Mm. Oh, you can watch me do a backflip. Okay, maybe I don't know that many tricks, but still, it's so cool that I can actually fly. Oh, I'm going to go do so many fun things with this. Uh, Junior, I'm kind of worried about Matthew. I mean, he shouldn't have that much power. It's gonna get to his head. What do you think? Jesus, Luigi, why are you always up in his business? Just let him live his life. If something's actually wrong, then he'll figure it out eventually. Mm, I guess you're right. I just can't help but feel like he's gonna do something stupid with his powers. Hmm, why are apartments called apartments if they're next to each other? That doesn't make any sense. They're not apart. Hmm. Hey, Bowser! Guess who finally has the ability to fly? Uh, well, there's no one else in the room with us, so you, I guess? Ding, ding, ding! That's correct! And my next question is, who's about to go for a very, very scary ride? Uh, what? Up you go! Wait, whoa! Whoa, jeez, Bowser, you're really heavy. Anyways, Bowser, check this out. Look at how far you are above the ground. How do you feel? Oh, Mario, please put me down. I'm afraid of heights. Oh, no, you really think I'm going to let you off that easily? Not after all of our history. And you know what? I think I have a much better idea. You see that ceiling fan right there? Oh, no, please, Mario, not the ceiling fan. Anything but that. Too bad. Oh, oh, oh Mario, what was that for? Bowser, I literally just explained why I did that. Because we're enemies. We have history together. I mean, you always overpower me with your crazy inventions and superpowers. Like, I've always wanted to do that. But now that I have my very own superpower, I can finally do what I want to do. So, ha, take that. <laughs> You're crazy, Mario. You know that? You're really crazy. <laughs> Ow. Oh man, that was fun. Finally got my revenge against Bowser. But I am starting to get kind of hungry. Maybe I'll go get a snack from the kitchen. Whee! All right, these Easter cookies are going to be so good by the time I'm done making them. It is kind of early for Easter cookies, though, so I don't know why they had these at the store. Hey, Yoshi, look at me. I can actually fly now. Huh? This is so awesome. Yeah, I already knew you could fly, Mario. Word's been literally flying around the house about it. So, you jealous or what? Mm, no, I'm fine with my flutter jump. It works just fine for me. <laughs> See, Mario, I can kind of fly. Oh. Ugh, not for long, though. Oh my god, Yoshi, you're so weak. All right, anyways, I'm kind of hungry, so I'm gonna go get the Tostito Scoops from the top of the pantry. Well, the Tostito Scoops? No, Mario, get down! I put those at the top of the pantry for a reason. You wouldn't stop hogging them for yourself. Save some for the others. Oh, and who's gonna stop me, Yoshi? I can literally fly. I can get whatever I want from the top of here. Now, I'm gonna eat my chips whether you like it or not. No, 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 Mario, look, I'll make you something else if you're really that hungry. It's just not good to eat that many chips at the same time. It's unhealthy. Hmm, I don't know. Okay, fine, Yoshi, I'll trust you on this one, but if the food's not good, then I'm I'm gonna eat the rest of the chips, okay? Okay, that sounds like a deal. I'll go get your food right now, and I guarantee you it'll be a lot more delicious than those chips. More delicious than the chips? What is he talking about? He's being crazy. But, oh well, I gotta give him the benefit of the doubt, I guess. Okay, Mario, I've got you your orange slices right here. Trust me, they're really, really good, and they're a lot better than those oranges, so yeah, I hope you enjoy them. Hmm, orange slices, huh? I haven't had an orange in a long time, so I don't know what to expect, but oh well. So, what do you think? Are they good? <gasps> oh my god. 
This has to be the best orange I've ever had in my life. Like, it, it tastes way better than any other oranges I've eaten. Yoshi, how did you even make this? Uh, I didn't make it. It's just an orange. I cut it up into little slices. Well, for some reason, something about it tastes really good. Oh, I have to finish this. Oh, well, I'm glad you like it, Mario. Oh, finally, he's eating healthy for once. You know, maybe I kind of like Mario as a bee. He's not that bad. Mm, oh, my God. I'm so full. But I'm full of some of the best oranges I've ever had in my life. Well, thanks for the oranges, Yoshi. Oh, shoot. Uh. Yoshi, I think I have to go to the bathroom. Uh, okay, and why are you telling me this? Just go. Okay, oh god, I don't think I can hold it. Oh, thank god the bathroom's right here. I have to go right now. Uh, Junior, do you think Mario's okay? Luigi, I swear to god, if you say his name one more time, I'm calling the psych ward. <sighs> okay. Oh my god, what the heck is that? Yeah, Junior, I'm gonna need you to take back what you just said. This sounds really suspicious. Mario! Mario, are you okay? Where even are you? I'm right here, Luigi. I'm in the bathroom. Oh, hey, come on, Junior. He says he's in here. Okay, Mario, I'm here. Is something wrong? Okay, first of all, I didn't really ask you to come in here. That's kind of creepy that you just walked in on me in the bathroom. Yeah, Luigi, respect this privacy. That's weird. Anyways, guys, the craziest thing just happened. Look at the toilet. You'll see it. Uh, okay, gross. So why are you showing us this? Yeah, Mario, we know you can use the bathroom. It's not that big a deal. You guys really don't see it yet? That's literally honey. I just made honey. I didn't even think that was possible. Whoa, whoa, whoa wait, you peed honey? Well, how did you do that? I don't know. I guess that's just one of the perks of being a bee. Uh, I don't think actual bees can do that, but... Oh, well, that's a pretty cool superpower, Mario. Thanks, Junior. But guys, imagine all the possibilities we can do with this. I mean, you can make some homemade honey nut Cheerios. We can make some honey-scented candles. We can... Are you actually suggesting that we eat your pee? Uh, Luigi, I don't know if you know this, but you can't actually eat candles. Well, no, I'm talking about the first thing you said. Why are you suggesting that we eat your pee? Yeah, that is kind of weird, Mario. I don't want to have any of those meals. Guys, I just told you, it's not pee, it's honey. I mean, you're seeing it right there, so imagine all the possibilities we can have with this. Uh, no, no, I'd rather not. Come on, Junior, this is really gross. Mm, I don't know. I mean, if it actually is honey, though, then I'm sure it's good. Junior, just come on. Okay. Whatever, guys, stay jealous. I don't have to listen to these haters. Hmm... So this really is honey, huh? <sighs> that was gross. Oh god, I hear him coming back. Hey Luigi, guess what? I actually just tried the honey and it tastes really good. Trust me, you're missing out. Mario, can you please stop talking about honey? It gets grosser the more you talk about it. Okay, okay, I'm sorry Luigi. But Luigi, I didn't realize how cool it is to actually be a bee. I mean, there's so much cool stuff I can do. Like, I can fly, I can make honey, you know? Like, there's so much cool stuff I can do. Mario, that's exactly why I have a problem with you being a bee. I mean, there's so much power you have and with all the cool stuff you can do, I don't want the power go in your head. Oh, stop it Luigi, your jealousy's showing again. You really think people would listen? Listen to you, you sound like a lunatic. I mean, look at how cool I look. Oh, 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 Mario, don't pull me like that. Why is your tail so sharp? Wait, my tail? My tail is spiky? <gasps> Luigi, that's another cool thing. I have my very own built-in weapon. So if I ever want to go poking people around, then I can because I have a really spiky tail. Mario, I don't think having a spiky tail is that cool. I mean, Bowser has one and he doesn't brag about it. That's because Bowser is a sorry little numbnut who doesn't understand how cool it is to have a spiky tail. Now, if you excuse me, I'm going to go poke everyone on on site. See ya. Well, Mario, come back! Ugh, he's really starting to get on my nerves today. Okay, Mario, so you have the spiky tail, and now you can poke whoever you want and pretend like it's an accident. But who should I poke first? Oh, man, I must have set a new world record for the most toilet paper you... Uh, hey, Iggy, what's up? Oh my god, Mario, that has to be the goofiest costume I've ever seen. Like, why even wearing that? Well, it's not really a costume. It's actually my... I mean, look at those stupid antennas on your head. Maybe that's where I've been getting my cell signal from. And where did you even get that hat anyway? Like, Hot Topic? Oh my god. Ugh, shut up, Iggy. I didn't come here for you to roast my appearance that I didn't pick. Oh yeah, you couldn't decide your appearance. Just like how your parents couldn't decide whether or not they wanted to keep you on birth. Iggy, you were literally adopted. I don't want to hear it from you. I mean, hey, at least I was wanted. <laughs> Whoa, I didn't even know I could do that. Oh, Mario, what was that for? That really happened. I don't know. I didn't even mean to do that. I guess an urge just came over me because I got so angry. Wait a minute. I just realized. I didn't ever think about this. I'm a bee, and I just stung him. Oh, my God. This is going to be so much fun. <laughs> Where'd they go? 
Hey, Bowser, you see these little yellow things on my hat? I want you to touch them. Uh, that sounds really suspicious. Why would I do that, Mario? Well, because they look like macaroni. You like macaroni, don't you? <gasps> you got me there. I do love macaroni. All right, Mario, I guess I'll do what you say. Oh, oh, oh my God, what was that? <laughs> Bowser, I got you. You just got beat. Oh my God, that was so good. Oh, beat? What does that even mean? That doesn't make any sense. Shh. <laughs> Oh my god, that was so funny. Wee! Uh, what in the world has gotten into him? Hey, Luigi, guess what? What is it, Matty? Oh, 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 what the hell? <laughs> Yet another person has been beat! Huh? That's so funny. Uh, you know what? I have had enough of Matthew Day. He's just been causing trouble all around the house, and I'm sick of it. So I guess I'm gonna have to take matters into my own hands. Oh, man, it's been a long day. I just want to get a snack. I'm so hungry. Oh, hey, guys, what's up? Guys? Why are you staring at me like that? You don't look happy. Hey, do you think if I flew up to the ceiling, then your eyes would follow? You know, like if I flew up here like, wee, wee. Oh my god, that'd be so funny. You know, just like seeing your heads go up and down. Matthew, stop trying to change the subject. You know what you did, and we are sick and tired of everything that you've been doing to us today. So you know what? We've all made an executive decision to decide that you are out. You are kicked out of this house until you stop stinging people. W what? Well, kicked out? You can't kick me out. I'm an essential part of this house. Well, if you're going to keep hurting us all the time, then we don't want you as a part of the house. Exactly, Junior. So, Maddio, we order you to get out of this house immediately or we're going to call the police. Y you're really just going to kick me out of the house? Just like that? Yes. <sighs> okay. Fine, guys. I understand your decision. But, can I request one thing? Can I please get some food before I go? Like, I don't want to leave on an empty stomach. Didn't you literally just eat, like, an hour ago? I fed you those oranges. Whoa, whoa, wait, Yoshi. Okay, Mario, you can have one more snack before you go. But, as soon as you're done with it, you are out of this house until further notice. Okay, that's fine. That buys me enough time, and it gets some free food. Okay, time to choose a... Luigi, what are you doing? I'm watching you to make sure you only get one piece of food. Uh, okay. Um... Hey, look at this one. Look, it's got some funny glasses on it. Isn't that funny? Oh, man, there's so many pieces of food to choose from. Uh, which one should I pick? The one that makes you leave the fastest? Oh, um... Hey, uh, nice house we have here, am I right? Matthew, can you just pick something already? I know you're stalling time. Do I really have to leave? Yes, until you learn your lesson. Okay, I guess I'll just eat this mango right here. Oh, <gasps> Oh my god, that's a really good mango! Hey Luigi, you want a bite? Mm, no, you just ate out of it, so I don't want- No, 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 Luigi, trust me, this is like the best mango I've ever had in my life. Uh, okay, I guess it wouldn't hurt to try. Luigi, I promise you, you won't regret it. This better not be a prank! Luigi, why would I pull another prank? I'm getting kicked out of the house. Well, exactly, wouldn't you want to pull one last prank? Luigi, just eat the mango! Okay, fine. <gasps> oh my gosh, wait! That is a really good mango. You're right, Matteo. You see what I mean, Luigi? For some reason, everything I've eaten today tastes really good, and I don't know why. Hey, wait a minute. He had the same reaction to my oranges I gave him earlier. I knew my theory was correct. Your theory? What are you talking about, Yoshi? Luigi, don't you see it? I think Mario has the power to pollinate any food he wants since he's a bee. I mean, that's one of the main reasons we need bees in the first place, because they pollinate our food and make it taste better. So I think Mario's, like, double pollinating the food and making it taste amazing. Hmm, is he now? I don't believe it. I need to see for myself. Okay, let me just try this mango. Um, okay, it tastes just like a normal mango. Hi, right, Matthew, you bite into it. Can do. Um, um, um. Luigi, what are you talking about? This is even better than the last mango. Okay, now you try it, Luigi. Okay, I don't think it's gonna taste any different. Um, oh my gosh, wait. That tastes really good. What, Matthew, how are you doing that? How am I doing what? Sorry, I wasn't listening. I'm telling you, Luigi, it's the pollination. He's able to eat any food he wants and make it taste twice as good. Hmm, you know what? Hey, Maddio, maybe you can stay here as long as you pollinate all of our food whenever we request. Well, wait, you'll let me stay? Yes, as long as you pollinate all of our food. I'll pollinate your food any day if I can stay. Oh, well, thank you so much, Luigi. Good choice, Luigi. This will make my cooking even better than before. Yeah, with Maddio around, we won't have to eat at a restaurant ever again. Oh, man, all the possibilities. <sighs> Where is it? Where are the Loud House reruns? I want to feel stupider than I already am. What the heck is that? Is that a bunch of people? Where are they coming from? It sounds like it's coming from the backyard. Uh, hello? What's all that? 
Whoa. Get your food or drinks pollinated. One dollar only. Uh, yes. Yeah, so basically, my dog won't really eat his food. So I'm hoping that you can pollinate his food and make it taste better. Uh, well, I don't really want to eat dog food, but I guess this is what I signed up for. Okay, I guess I'll pollinate it. Uh, oh, there you go. I ate the can. That pollinated it. Oh, thank you so much, sir. Mr. Meowsworth will love this. Let me go get your dollar. Why would you name a dog Mr. Meowsworth? There you go. Hope you have an amazing day. You too. Pleasure doing business with you. All right, who's next? Uh, yes, it's me. I was wondering if you could uh, pollinate my water so it could taste better. You want me to make water taste better? It doesn't even taste like anything to begin with. Hey, at least I'm not wearing a traffic cone for clothes. Don't question what I want. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. All right, let me just do this. <sighs> All right, there you go. Oh, thank you so much, sir. That was so very kind of you. You too. Come back anytime. Oh, man, I've actually made a couple dollars off of this. This could be a pretty profitable business. I see your pollination powers are starting to pay off. Oh, you bet they are. I've already made a couple dollars off of it. It's pretty awesome. I mean, all I have to do is try people's food, and I make money off of it. Oh, well, that's fun. I hope you're having fun with it. You bet I am. This has to be one of the best and easiest jobs I've ever worked. Well, I'm glad you managed to find something good out of all this. I'm just going to go chill inside. All right, see you, Luigi. All right, who's next? I'm taking up the next customer. So you're pollinating food, huh? That doesn't make any sense. Humans can't pollinate. Uh, well, technically, I'm not actually a human. I'm actually a bee. Oh, yeah. You really want me to believe that? You know how many times I've heard that excuse whenever people make fraudulent businesses? F fraudulent? Well, there's nothing fraudulent about this. I'm actually pollinating people's stuff. If you want a free sample, I'd be glad to give you one. Oh, no. I don't want any of whatever weird stuff you're selling. But what I do want is to see your business license. Uh, business license? That's none of your business. <laughs> you get it? Okay, sir, just show me your business license before I airstrike your house over how bad that joke was. Uh, I don't have a business license. I was just doing this for fun. Can't a bee just start a small little company in his backyard? No, he can't, because you need a business license to start a business. And since you really think you're a bee, you wouldn't mind if I did this, would you? you did what? What are you possibly gonna do to me? Oh, no. Haha, <laughs> got a new prototype of raid spray right here. It's supposed to kill 99.99999% of insects. Now, get out of my neighborhood! Ah, oh my god! Stop spraying me with that! It really hurts! Stop spraying me! We don't need more people like you in this neighborhood! Money laundering thief! <coughs> Luigi! Luigi, are you out here? I feel like I'm dying! Yeah, Matthew, I'm here. I never actually went inside. As soon as I saw the cop in line, I knew something was up. Come on, buddy, we'll drag you inside. <coughs> oh, please help! Oh, ow! Ow! Uh, so he actually sprayed you with raid, huh? Yes, yes, he did, Luigi. Some type of raid. I don't know. It hurts so badly. Whoa, so you actually were a bee this whole time. Isn't it obvious, Junior? God, it hurts so badly. Oh, oh I feel like I'm... I, I feel like I'm, uh, uh, oh my god, what the heck just happened? I feel like my organs just exploded. <gasps> Wait a minute, well, guys, Mario's back. Well, I guess the officer was right. It really does kill 99% of insects. No, you idiot, it just killed him as a bee. He was still a human in the first place. Anyways, Mario, how do you feel? Well, if I'm being completely honest, I still feel like I'm in a lot of pain, so I guess I should just lay down until it goes away. <laughs> oh, oh god, it hurts. Oh. Am I still kicked out, Luigi? Well, the original reason we kicked you out was because you kept on stinging people, but now that you're not a bee, you can't do that anymore. So, uh, yeah, you can stay. Uh, thank God. Thank you, Luigi. Ugh, sorry for all the trouble I caused, guys. It's not every day that you get powers like that, but that doesn't justify what I did. Well, you're fine. Don't worry about it. But I will say, my skin is feeling kind of itchy. Huh, now that you mention it, so is mine, and I feel like I'm swelling in a couple areas. Yeah, same for me. Wait, you guys' skin is also itching? I thought I was the only one. Oh, God, not again. Well, here goes nothing. I guess it's time to go look for my phone in the woods. Oh my god, I can't believe how this even happened. All right, Luigi, let's play catch. Although, don't throw it too far. I don't really want to get it lost. But, uh, yeah, catch. <laughs> you know I can't turn down a game of this. <laughs> Whoa, you're getting a little full yourself with these throws, Luigi. You're probably going to end up getting it lost. <laughs> oh, you really think that was going to get it lost? Oh, watch this. Ah. <laughs> Did you just do the exact thing that I told you not to do? <gasps> uh, it wasn't me! Well, Luigi, you- Oh my god, now I have to go look for this thing! <sighs> Man, he never takes responsibility for his actions. Well, I guess it's up to me now, so... Better just go start looking in this weird forest thing. Ugh, I don't like coming in here. Uh, well, this forest has got a really creepy feel to it. I don't know how I feel. I mean, I've never been this deep into it. <gasps> Wait, what is that? Oh, huh, no way. It's my phone. Oh, I can't believe I found it. I can't believe it's safe. 
All right, now all I have to do is just get this phone, go back inside, and then I can yell at Luigi for not helping me because I really needed help with this. Okay, now let me just get this phone. What's that noise? Why is that tree shaking? Oh no. Oh god, oh god, the tree's falling towards me! Ah! Breathe, Mario. Breathe. Come on, man. Come on. I know you're somewhere in there. You have to fight, okay? There's no way you could be dead. And we're not gonna let you die if you're not. Come on, man. Come on, fight! You have to come back! Mario. Mario, please. If you can hear me, you're the only one that can stop this now. We have everything set up for you. You just have to breathe. Just keep fighting. Keep fighting, man. Come on. Come on, Mario. Come back! Oh, no. We've tried everything, but his heartbeat's been gone for more than two minutes, so I think... I... I think we lost him. Oh, Mario! You poor soul! Who's that? Who's calling my phone? Ah, hello? Uh, yes. Uh, hello, Luigi. I'm calling you from MK Hospital today to let you know that your brother Mario is here sitting in the hospital bed and we try to do everything we can, but unfortunately, your brother Mario has passed away. But passed away? Pff, what are you talking about? Matthew's not dead. I just saw him earlier today. Uh, yeah. Well, I guess while you were away from him, that must have been when he passed away because a pedestrian filed a police report saying that he found a man crushed underneath a tree. And when we brought him in, there was nothing we can do. We have all the equipment and everything, but he was already out cold. So, sorry to let you know, but... Yeah, your brother Mario has unfortunately passed away. You can come visit him if you want, but there's nothing we can do about it now. A tree fell on him? Are you serious? That's the best story you could come up with? Okay, look, man, I understand that this is a prank call, but you really shouldn't joke about things like this, okay? I'm only laughing because of how ridiculous that story is. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna hang up now. Wait, don't hang up! You're the only person in this family that can read! Oh man, the lengths that people will go to just to prank call me. You know what, I'm gonna go tell the others about that. That was funny. Oh my god, guys, you won't believe it. The weirdest thing just happened. I just got the stupidest prank call in the world. Oh my god, it was so funny. What are you guys doing? Oh, hey, Luigi. Me and Junior are having an argument over these coins and whether or not they can be used as real money. Dad, these are literally arcade tokens. You can only use them at the arcade. And come to think of it, most of the games there don't even use the tokens. So, like, it's basically like a free arcade. Why would you want to use these? Junior, they're still coins. I mean, like, they look like coins, you know, they sound like coins. These are coins, Junior. You can use these anywhere. No, Dad. These coins are only supposed to be used for the... Can I get to my story? This is a really pointless argument. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Luigi. What's going on? Okay, so basically, I got this really weird prank call from a doctor saying that Madio passed away earlier today. Like, what is he talking about? I was literally with Madio earlier. How could he have passed away already? I mean, you never know. Death is kind of unpredictable. And was it Dr. Paratrooper? Because if not, then it's probably a scam. You mean the doctor we usually get? Yeah, was it him? Uh, I mean, the voice sounded kind of familiar. Maybe it was him. Well, and then that's probably legit, Luigi. Why would an actual doctor prank call you? Are you sure the stork didn't come back and pick him back up? Well, Dad, what are you talking about? You know how there's those stork bird thingies that drop off babies at doors? That's a fictional story. Guys, guys, come on. Look, it'll all be okay. Matthew's not dead. I mean, I know for a fact he's not dead. That was just a doctor that was trying to play a really, really late April Fool's prank that's also really messed up. I'm gonna make sure we never use that doctor ever again. That was cruel. Okay, I'm gonna go enjoy the rest of my day. I just wanted to see what you guys thought of that story. I'll see you later. Uh, yeah. Bye, Luigi. Dad, I think we should actually go see if Mario's okay. Well, I mean, if the doctor said he's dead, then doesn't that mean he's dead? Yeah, but I'm also starting to wonder if Luigi's prank call theory was a possibility. I mean, shouldn't the doctor have came directly to our door with that type of news? They shouldn't just do a phone call. I mean, that's devastating news. Why didn't he tell us in person? I think we should probably run a search on Mario. Yeah, I guess that's true. So what do you want to do? You want to put some flowers around the neighborhood? Yeah, th that's exactly the idea I was thinking of. Well, how'd you know, Dad? Trust me, Junior. I eat a lot of kale salad. Well, let's just go set up these flyers. Okay. Wait, where am I? What am I doing here? Wait, am I at the doctor's office? What is he doing? Oh god, I really tried my best to bring him back. I did, but now he's just a lifeless corpse. Oh, what am I supposed to do? How do I explain this to my boss? Oh. Lifeless corpse? What is he talking about? Wait a minute, speaking of which, why can't I see my own body? Hmm, what could this be? <gasps> Wait a minute, I think I'm a ghost. 
no way, that's so cool. But I wonder if anyone can hear me. I mean, I'm just in my thoughts right now, but if I talk, can anyone hear me? <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna go on my lunch break. I have to be distracted from all this. <gasps> oh shoot, he's leaving the room. I have to do it. Uh, hey, hey, can you hear? Oh shoot, he already left the room. Dang it, I really wanted to see if people could hear me. I mean, clearly he couldn't see me because he would have had some kind of reaction, but I don't know if he can hear me. Huh, well, I guess I'm a ghost now, which is really interesting, but really freaky too. I wonder how I look as a ghost. Nah, oh well, I'll just figure that out later. I just gotta find my way home. Wait, this phone's going off. <gasps> this could be my test to see if I can pick up objects. Okay, let's see. Uh, oh, I can! Okay, okay, let me just answer this phone. Uh, uh, hello? <laughs> hey, is your refrigerator running? Uh, how do these kids keep on finding me no matter what? Oh, well, I have to stay quiet. I'm just gonna see if I can go home. Uh, can I crash through the ceiling? Uh, All right, Dad, so I just made this flyer that we can hopefully use to find Mario, so let me know what you think of it. Uh, I mean, it's fine, but what's the point of the picture of Mario on it? But because we're literally looking for Mario. Did you forget the entire point of this flyer? <gasps> oh, right, 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 right. Sorry, I forgot about that. Uh, yeah, it looks pretty good. You can go print it out now. Alrighty, we'll do right now. Okay, the printer is finally done printing. Let's see what we got. Let's just uh, take this out and. Ah! Why did the printer print pictures of Mario? Oh, get him away! Get him away! Oh, yeah, right. That's the entire point of this. Okay, let's put these around the neighborhood. <laughs> All right, Dad, that should be the last of the posters. I really hope this works. That is, if he's still alive. Yeah, I mean, hopefully it does something, but it still doesn't really cover every circumstance. Like, what if Mario purposely ran away from us, you know? I mean, then maybe he'd, like, take off all his clothes and then put on a whole new identity, so maybe this picture wouldn't really work that well. Oh, come on, Dad. Mario wouldn't run away from us. We treat him great, uh, I think. All right, let's just go back inside and hope that we get a phone call. Okay, sounds good. Oh well, someone will find it. Ah, oh man, there's nothing good on TV today. Ah, ah. Luigi, what are you doing? I'm trying to find a channel to watch, but this TV won't move no matter what button I press. Ah, ah, why is it so broken? Ah. Luigi, why aren't you helping with Mario's case? I mean, if he's actually dead, then you're his brother. Shouldn't you care about it more than anyone else? Guys, guys, how many times do I have to tell you this? Matthew's not dead. He's definitely just playing a joke on us or something. He'll come back. I mean, he would have called me by now if he was in actual danger. Wait a minute. He lost his phone in the forest earlier, and and the doctor said that he died because a tree fell on him. Oh my god, guys, he might have actually died! I told you, Luigi, why do you never take these things seriously? Well, it's kind of hard to take anything seriously when you get prank calls all the time. Do you get prank calls about Mario being dead all the time? Well, no, but the story was so crazy that I just figured it was a prank. Oh no, oh my god. Why is it always Matthew that gets hurt in these videos? Why can't it be anyone else? Oh no, Matthew! Matthew! I'm coming for you! You can't be dead! You can't be! Wow, that's probably the most normal reaction I've ever seen come out of Luigi. Well, if Mario's actually dead, then hopefully he finds a way to cope with it. Oh god, oh god, but Matthew! Matthew! Oh god, please tell me it's just a joke or something! Please tell me it's just hiding! Matthew! Oh god, please tell me it's somewhere around here! You have to be in here somewhere! Or at least somewhere around the house, but Matthew! Oh no, you're not in there! Uh, not there, no! Uh, not there, no! Uh, are you in the microwave? Uh, no! Uh, what about the oven? Uh, no, we already learned our lesson from last time. Uh, are you down here? No! Uh, I doubt you're in any of those! Oh god, where is he? Are you in the pantry? Uh, no, we don't have anything in here. Uh, what about the freezer? Uh, in here? No! Uh, what about the fridge? Uh, no, you're not in there. <gasps> what about the bathroom? Yeah, you always have your cramps. <laughs> All right, Matthew, your fun and games are over. I've got to now. I like this. Matthew? Oh, come on! I really thought he'd be in his favorite bathroom. Why isn't he in here? Where could he possibly be? <gasps> Wait, the, the tree. The, the tree must have been in our backyard. Oh, I gotta go look at the backyard. <laughs> Matthew? Matthew? Oh, come on, this is the forest that we played the game in. He has to be here. Wait a minute. Is that his phone? Uh, oh my gosh, there's his phone. And this must have been the tree that fell on him. So that means that if Matthew's not here, then he, he actually d died. <laughs> oh, come on, Matthew. You couldn't stick the landing. That's that's not very appropriate to say, but oh, oh my god, man, you, you actually died. Uh, curse you tree, you stupid tree. You got all this like, uh, I'm, I'm gonna say this is like acne. You got all this acne on you ugly tree. Why'd you have to kill my brother? Oh, oh, oh. Well, I guess there's nothing else to do but mourn my brother's death. And I'm gonna take his phone with him too. 
Uh, I know it's not really raining outside, so the emotion I'm trying to give isn't that obvious, but just put like a raining sound effect over this. Yeah, that'll work. Ah, <sighs> man, going through doors is never gonna get old. Okay, I still can't really tell if anyone can hear me yet, so is Luigi in here? <gasps> Wait, there he is! Okay, let me go see if I can talk to him, because if he can hear me, then maybe he can find a way to see me too! Oh, this is gonna be cool. I just, I don't know what to do anymore. I mean, madio has been through a lot. I mean, he was even in a coma, but at least most comas are recoverable, so I knew he was probably gonna be okay, but death is completely different. You just, you don't come back. What am I gonna do without my only brother in my life? Oh, man, he's taking the news pretty hard. I wish there was something I could do about this. I can't look at my brother like this. <gasps> it's almost like I can hear his voice. Oh, wait a minute. That's stupid. That's just my imagination. Stop it, brain. You have to get over him. He's dead. <laughs> wait, L Luigi, can you actually hear me? Uh, stop it, brain. Stop playing tricks on me. This isn't funny. Oh, if I could take you out of my head right now, I would. Uh, well, that probably won't be necessary. I'm pretty sure someone already did that a long time ago. <gasps> wait, th that sounds exactly like something Maddie would say. But Maddie, are you here? Where are you? Well, Luigi, I'm right behind you. I'm a ghost. Oh my god, wait, he can actually hear me. This is amazing. You're right behind me. Where? I don't see you. <gasps> oh, wait, I see what's going on here, and it's not very funny. Are you sure one of you guys isn't just hiding around here? Come on, I know it's you. <gasps> or you must be one of the other ghosts pretending to be Mario. <sighs> oh my god, are you serious? I mean, aren't there more fun things to do in the afterlife than this? <sighs> Cut the act, Luigi. Ow! Oh, why would you slap me? That really hurt, Matt. Mario. Okay, those are two things that Maddie would do, so it's definitely you. Wait, what are you doing here then? Why aren't you in heaven? I don't know, that's exactly what I'm wondering, but I'm trying to see if I can get my life back together. So are you sure that you can't see me, Luigi? Uh, well, if you're standing right in front of me, then no. <gasps> Unless you're behind me! Oh, wait, we already established this. So wait, you want to figure out a way to where everybody can see you again? Because I can hear you, but I can't see you anywhere. Yeah, but I fear it's going to be a lot more complicated than we thought. Plus, at this point, I'm just focused on making sure that you can see me. Because once you can see me, then we can figure out how to make everyone else see me. Hmm, okay, I like the sound of that. Hot right, Maddio, let's go find a way to make you visible again. Hmm, okay, so it looks like I'm completely invisible in the mirror. Man, I'm super invisible. How are we supposed to fix this? Well, I mean, we could always try. Uh, hey, Luigi, what's up? <laughs> uh, hey, Yoshi, uh, nothing much. So what are you doing? Uh, well, judging by that reaction, I'm just gonna assume that you don't want me to be here, so I'll see you later. Uh, okay, bye. Well, wait, Yoshi, uh, come back. You're the smart one. You can probably figure this out. Uh, okay, you know what? Screw it. He's already gone. So, what's our plan? Okay, Mario, are you ready? R ready for what? I don't know what's going on. Oh, <laughs> oh it smells so bad. What is that? Uh, you know, I have no idea. I want to say kind of out of ideas at this point. Well, I mean, I have an idea. All right, Luigi, turn the water on. Hopefully this will wash away my ghostness or something. Uh, are you sure you want me to do this, Mario? Yes, Luigi, just do it. Okay, let me just turn this that way. Do you feel anything? Uh, nope. Let's try something else. Oh, but I can't think of anything else. Oh, man, why is this so hard? Oh, man, this is pointless. Why is it so hard just to find a way for people to see ghosts? I mean, you see ghosts in movies all the time. It can't be that hard. <gasps> Wait a minute, Maggie, that's it. Okay, so we have to go to Hollywood, and we have to go ask one of those film director guys how they can see ghosts. Luigi, I'm not even going to explain why that doesn't make sense. So let's just see what we can find in the house, okay? Hmm, you know, I've always wondered why Bowser has so much weird medicine. Like... Wild Alaskan fish oil. What the hell even is that? Like, what does that even do? Hmm, well, you know, I mean, I am already dead, so, I mean, me eating this wouldn't really do anything, so. What's the worst that could happen? Let's try some of this medicine. Uh, uh Maddie, don't you think it's a bad idea just to eat random pills that you don't know the consequences of? Well, Luigi, I'm glad you finally bounced back and said something logical, unlike what you said before, but I am a ghost, so it's like, what's the worst that could happen? I die again? So, I guess I should just see what these do. Uh, here we go. <laughs> oh, God, Maddie, please stop. I don't want things to become worse. <laughs> Calm down, Luigi. It'll all be okay. I'm a ghost, remember? And besides, I only ate, like, one pill. See, all the rest of them are here, so I guess I'm just gonna have to keep trying all these pills till I see what they do. So, what does this one do? Well, do you see anything? Uh, uh, yeah, I'm definitely seeing something. We should probably get our house checked out after this. I had no idea that we had an infestation. An infestation of what? Pills? Because that's all I'm seeing here, and that would make the most sense. I mean, there's pills everywhere. 
Come to think of it, that was actually kind of cool when you picked up that pill bottle, you know, it was like floating. That was kind of cool. Oh yeah, I guess that would look pretty cool. If only I could see that. Anyways, Luigi, I think we actually found our thing. Like, I think you're supposed to eat one of these pills and then you can see the ghost. <gasps> well, wait, really? Oh my God, this is so awesome. I can't believe we finally found it. Okay, man, you're like, can't wait to see you. Time to eat one of these pills. Um, 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 um. Huh, you know, that tastes kind of bad. I don't know how I feel about- <gasps> Oh my gosh, Matthew, it's you! Wait, you can actually see me, Luigi? Yes, I can see you, it's a miracle! Ah, oh, sweet, I can't believe we actually figured this out! Oh, finally, now I'm one step away from living back to my original life. Now all we have to do is just give these pills to the rest of our friends, and then I can live my life as normal. Uh, as nor- <gasps> Wait, Luigi, I just realized, maybe instead of trying to get out of this ghost body, I can take advantage of it! You know what that means? Uh, no, I don't really know what that means. Can you tell me? Oh, come on, you idiot. You know exactly what I mean. We can play some pranks. <gasps> I like the sound of this. Oh, my prankster alter ego is finally going to come back. So when do we get to do this? Well, uh, I'm still a ghost, right? Uh, yeah, obviously. Well, then we can start it right now. Let's go mess with people. Oh, yeah. Let's go mess with everybody. Hmm, interesting. Wait, what? Where is my laptop going? Why is it flying away? <laughs> well, I guess that's why they call it the MacBook Air. <laughs> oh, wait. I have a MacBook Pro. <laughs> I'm making bed angels. <laughs> what the f- Okay, you know what? Whatever. Oh, don't worry. I've got this, Luigi. <laughs> Ah, 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 what the heck just happened? Why did I just hit the wall? I was just trying to make my bed angels. <gasps> Maybe those are the angels. They're calling out for me. Yeah, this kid has major problems. Ah, why aren't any of the good channels on? I'm tired of watching nothing. Ah, ah. Okay, Matthew, go pick him up from his hair and see if he freaks out. Oh, it's going to be so funny. You got it, Ouija. Ouija? Huh, I haven't heard that name in a long time. Ah, what is this TV problem going to get fixed? Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh my god, what the heck is going on? Oh my god, I'm scared of heights, I'm scared of heights, please pull me down! Whatever is holding me up, please pull me down! Whoa, Bowser, you are being haunted! Well, no, I'm not being haunted, that's ridiculous, okay? Tell me what's actually going on. What, are you serious? Okay, uh, Bowser, you have been chosen to win a free Macy's gift card! All you have to do is give me your credit card detail! <gasps> a free Macy's gift card? Okay, okay, my credit card number is 5861. Oh, oh, hey, what was that for? I was in the middle of giving my credit card number. Oh my god, you're a complete idiot. Why didn't I prank you first? You're so gullible. P prank? What are you talking about? Do I still get the Macy's gift card? Hello? Uh, oh man, Matthew, those pranks were so much fun. But I'm really tired now, so what do you think we should do now? Hmm. <gasps> Luigi, maybe we should go to like a 7-Eleven and we can take all the snacks and drinks, you know? Like we can get like five slushies and a bunch of candy bars and that would be so much fun, you know? <gasps> oh yeah, and then they wouldn't be able to do anything about it because they can't see you. Exactly, Luigi. I like the way you think. Yeah, exactly, man. Yo, that'd be so much fun. Uh, do you think they have Milky Ways though? Uh, Luigi, what are you doing? <gasps> oh, hey, Junior. I'm just having a conversation with Madio. Can't you see? What? No, Luigi, you can't see me, remember? Uh... You're talking to Mario? Uh, yeah, obviously, he's my brother, and I'm going to talk to him. Can't two brothers talk to each other every once in a while? Uh, uh, okay, look, Luigi, I know Mario's death probably meant a lot to you, and you're probably really upset about it, but I don't really know if this is the right way to cope about it. What do you mean, Junior? He seems to be doing just fine. We've been having a conversation this whole time. Exactly, man. You'll see, Junior, I told you. Uh, I- uh, What? Uh, uh, okay, somebody must have spiked my breakfast this morning. I'm clearly hearing things. Deny the truth all you want, Junior. I told you Maddio's not dead. He's here in spirit. Oh, that was pretty good, Maddio. Yeah, that was pretty good. Although, I don't really know if that was the best decision. I mean, shouldn't we keep it a secret that I'm secretly here? Oh, come on, Maddio. It'll be fine. I'm the only one who knows how to see you. Trust me, Maddio. This will be our little secret forever. At least, not until we find out how to get you back in your original body. Yeah, we should really figure that out soon. Okay, there's definitely either something wrong with my head or Luigi's head. I don't know. I'm just feeling kind of weird after seeing that. I'm going to get, like, a hot pocket to distract myself or something. Wait. What's this? Why are there pills laying out on the counter? Hmm, well, I mean, maybe instead of a Hot Pocket, I could have some candy. All right, let me eat some of this candy. Oh my God, that was the wrong kind of candy. Am I gonna die? I feel so weird. I feel really sick too. Oh God, my stomach's already going off. 
Oh, this doesn't feel good. Luigi, uh, what do you think's wrong with me? Oh, that candy's really messing with my head. <sighs> Stupid Luigi. <gasps> Wait a minute. L Luigi, who are you talking to? Uh, what are you talking about, Junior? I'm not talking to anybody. I'm just talking to nothing, you know? Yep, there's nothing going on here. Wait, why does that ghost have a red hat on it? Is that Mario? <gasps> How would he know that? That's so specific. L Luigi, you hid the medicine, right? There's no way he can see me. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I hid the medicine in the... Uh, uh, oh, shoot. What's wrong, Luigi? Uh, I, I might have left the medicine open on the kitchen counter. Dude, are you serious? I thought this was supposed to be our little secret. I'm sorry, Manuel. I just got so excited with the thought of pranks that I forgot to clean up after myself. Luigi, you had one job, and that was the only thing you had to protect. Well, I... Uh, oh, my God. So, Mario's a ghost? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Dad! Yamshi, you have to hear this! <gasps> oh, no, Manuel. He's going to go tell the others. You have to stop him. Already on it, Luigi. <laughs> Dang, that ability is so cool. I wish I could do that. Oh my god, oh my god. Okay, Dad, Yoshi, I know it's crazy what I'm about to say, but... Uh, not right now, Junior. Me and Yoshi are trying to figure out how to fix the remote. Bowser, for the last time, you're never gonna get that thing to work with the TV. Uh, guys, this is serious. You have to hear me out. Okay, so I literally just saw Mario, and I just saw him as a... Ah! What the heck? Junior, what are you doing up there? Hey, ask them about the Macy's gift card. They didn't give it to me earlier. Uh, Dad, what the hell are you talking about? This is serious. I don't know how to get... Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay, that was really strange. Seems like something's going on here. Seems like the house is haunted of some sort. I'm gonna need to look into this and do some research, but I need a partner. Hey, Yoshi, do you have any free food? <sighs> if I give you some free food, then will you help me figure out what this whole paranormal mess is? Uh, yeah, sure. I'll do anything for some food. Uh, of course you will. Okay, Bowser, come with me. We're gonna go do some scientific research. Scientific? Science. Science. Sp spaghetti. Spaghetti. Oh, I want spaghetti! Hmm. I see. Uh, Bowser, do something. You're supposed to be my partner. No. Okay, and now all I've got to do is just convert the code so that this thing will understand it. Okay, let me just do some conversions, and done! Alright, it's finished! Let's go hunt for some ghosts, Bowser. What, ghosts? Do the ghosts have food? Hmm, interesting, very interesting. Uh, what exactly are you doing, Yoshi? Well, Bowser, since you apparently weren't paying attention, I specially coded this walkie-talkie to detect paranormal substances within the area. And when it does, it beeps really loudly, so we have to walk around. For now, it's just kind of beeping lightly because it can't find anything, but as soon as we find something, it's gonna beep super loud. Just watch. Uh, well, I'm not really hearing anything yet. Shouldn't we go to another room? Ugh, man, Bowser has some ugly clothes. Why does he even have these? They don't even fit him. What was that? <gasps> oh, Bowser, we're getting some signal. We should probably keep walking in this room. Hopefully there's some free food in there, which you still haven't given me, you scammer. W Bowser and Yoshi, what are they doing here? W whoa, whoa, what are these waves I'm feeling? They're so strong and they're making me tired. Ugh. Hmm, I mean, there has to be something in here. This radar thing is going crazy. I mean, it just keeps beeping over and over. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, I felt something. Okay, okay, let me just put this thing down. Let me try to feel my way around, because I felt something right here. Oh, oh, there definitely is something here. Okay, uh, what can I feel? Uh, I don't really know what this is. What, what is this? Whoa, 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 whoa. This part's really sticky. Oh, what is this? Uh, hello? Uh, hey, if you're a ghost, what part of this is you? I hope it's not the part that I think it is. Elsie, stop! Whoa, whoa, okay, okay, I'll stop. Okay, so this is definitely a ghost because he has a voice. So, uh, what's your name, little guy? Well, I know you're probably not gonna believe this, but it's Mario, Yoshi. Okay, look, so basically, I turned into a ghost since I died, but honestly, I've kind of lived my life as a ghost. I've already done everything I wanted to do, so now I'm just trying to get back to my human body. Can you help me, please? Whoa, wait a minute, you're Mario? Uh, okay, that actually explains a lot, but, uh, I don't really know that much about ghosts. I mean, I'd love to help you, but all I did was make this remote. I don't really know anything. Please, Yoshi, please just try to find a solution to this, okay? I can't live a normal life. I mean, the only way that people can actually see me is with a medication, meaning that not everybody is going to be able to see me. Not everyone's going to take that medicine just for me, okay? So I really want to live a normal life. Can you please try to find something, please? Okay, okay, Mario, okay. I'll try something, okay? Okay. Thanks, Yoshi. Oh, my God, I really hope this gets fixed soon. Bowser, what are you doing? Oh, I'm seeing if there's any free food in here. 
here. Yoshi promised me free food and he didn't give me any! Oh my god, I'm so mad about it. Oh, jeez. Okay, so Mario said that he died and then became a ghost, but now he wants to go back to his original body. Huh, man, that's kind of weird. I mean, I would never get tired of being a ghost. I mean, you could be invisible all the time. You can go and see people, but... Oh, uh, uh, yeah, right, I forgot. Nobody can see him, so... Can't live normally. It's only really fun for a temporary time, so... I see his point. So what should I do? Mm. <gasps> oh, I know! Okay, so I have to become a ghost, and then from there, I can figure out what to do. I'm smart enough. Now, uh, I just have to die in the same way that Mario did, so, uh... <gasps> oh, yeah, he fell on a tree! Okay, so, uh, well, no, the tree fell on him. But, okay, now I just have to go to the forest where he died! Okay, so apparently Mario died because a tree fell on him. That shouldn't be too hard to replicate. I can just find something in here. This shouldn't be too hot. W wait, what's this? <gasps> a fallen tree! Oh, this must have been how Mario died. Okay, so all I have to do is just, like, pick this up a little bit and... <laughs> Ah, wait, where am I? <gasps> wait a minute, Th this must be heaven! Oh man, it's so beautiful here! B but wait, this isn't where I wanted to come! No, I'm not a ghost yet! I'm supposed to be a ghost! L Hello? Hey, can somebody make me a ghost? L oh man, I'm stuck in heaven and I'm not even a ghost! Oh man, this sucks! What am I supposed to do? Yoshi, are you here yet? Why are you even looking for that brat? He never gave me my food. <sighs> because, Bowser, I have to look for him. He's the one that wants to save me. And clearly he's not here yet, so... I don't know what to do. Well, why is he supposed to be here? Well, because, Bowser, I overheard him in the other room saying that he was gonna die to help me, but if he's not here, then clearly he's either somewhere else or he's probably in heaven, so... I know how to get to heaven. I just have to die as a ghost. Just give me a second, Bowser. Where's my food? All I have to do is just sit in the microwave for a minute and hopefully I'll evaporate into non-existence. Okay, let me just get in. <laughs> Wait, Mario? Oh, hey, Yoshi. Oh, thank God you're here. I knew you were here. Yoshi, you do realize that you're not a ghost, right? Uh, yeah. Obviously, I figured that out by now, but I don't know why. I don't know what's going on. Greetings, my fellow earthlings or heavenlings. Who said that? So, I see you are in heaven because being a ghost just wasn't good enough. Uh, actually, I was never a ghost in the first place. Why is that? I mean, I was just trying to save Mario. Well, you sacrificed yourself to save your friend. However, purposely dying does not make you a ghost and instead gets you sent directly to heaven. What? You really thought you could cheat the system? Being a ghost is only for the elite member. Ha! <laughs> I knew it was an elite member! Not anymore. Oh. Look, you boys have done enough today. I think I'm just gonna put you guys back on your home planet. Whoa, wait, so you're gonna give us a second chance at life? But I actually died. I mean, shouldn't I stay here? Well, yes, but look, okay, heaven's too crowded. We don't have enough room for you guys. You've been through enough. Well, that's fine with us. Send us back, however you do. Okay, see you guys later. So, Junior, I just found out about this new thing called Netflix that lets you watch whatever show you want. Oh my god, it's so crazy. Okay, first of all, that's not really true anymore, and also, I think your brain is stuck in a whole other time period. <laughs> oh, 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 what happened? Wait a minute. <gasps> I have fingers again! Yeah, and I feel exactly the same as I felt a couple hours ago. Except, now I'm not in heaven anymore, so that's good. <gasps> Matthew, you're actually back! Oh my god, I miss you so much, buddy! I'm so glad you're back with us! And Yoshi, you're back too? Oh, wait, when did you die? Eh, it's kind of a weird story, but I sacrificed myself to get Mario back, and it worked, so at least we don't have any problems anymore. Yeah, that's true. Oh man, at least nobody actually died in the end. I'm getting a phone call. Give me a second, guys. Ah, uh, hello? Oh, yes, hello. Uh, I was calling because I saw your poster outside, and it kind of reminds me of my nephew, so if you'd like to speak with him over the phone, he thinks he knows who you guys are. Yeah, Luigi, I'm starting to see what you mean by the prank call stuff. Who's ready for the game night of our lives? Oh, me, 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 Luigi. Oh, man, we haven't had one of these game nights in forever. This is going to be so much fun. I completely agree, Mario. This game night's going to be so much fun. Wait a minute. Guys, where's my controller? Huh? What are you talking about, Junior? Uh, exactly what I said, Luigi. Where is my controller? I mean, you have a controller, Mario has a controller, but I don't have one. Where's mine? Y your controller? Well, yeah, how else am I supposed to play? It's a game night. Uh... Your controller, uh... Luigi, he has a controller, right? Well, yeah, 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 I'm pretty sure he does, but... I don't know if we have any other control... 
<gasps> oh, wait a minute. We do have a controller for you, Junior. Here, hold on. Let me get it. Here you go, Junior. You can have the pro controller. Yeah, no, everything's all good. I totally didn't just rob this off the neighbor, but yeah, yeah, yeah. No, everything's all good. W wow, Luigi. It only took you two minutes to find this controller? Yeah, they should really lock their doors next time. W what? Uh, nothing, nothing, nothing. I didn't say anything. Oh, uh, okay. Well, anyways, I'm really glad that you actually got me this good controller. I mean, I thought you were just gonna get me some crappy broken Joy-Con that had drift. I mean, wait, all of them have drift. But anyways, I'm so excited for this game now, guys! <laughs> and so are we, Junior. So, guys, what game do you want to play tonight? Mm, I don't know. I didn't really have any ideas for tonight. That's why I was hoping you guys would pick. Okay, let's see. What games do we have on the Switch? <gasps> oh, wait, I know. I think we can play the... Wait, what? Guys, what just happened? Why can't I see anything? Uh, Mad, yo, we all can't see anything. It looks like the power must have went out or something, which, I mean, it was storming earlier today, so I guess we were bound to get hit at some point. Uh, guys, this is scary. Turn the power back on. This prank isn't funny. Junior, we're not pulling a prank. We've literally all been in here this entire time. How could you possibly think one of us did it? I don't know, Mario. It was just a theory. Junior, don't say it. Don't say what? Oh, I thought you were gonna do that thing where you say, It's just a theory. A uh, game theory. Y you know, like the YouTube channel. Would you shut up? You're such a nerd. I wasn't gonna say that. Anyways, it's so dark and scary in here. I can barely see anything. I mean, we're even at- Wow! Okay, one of us needs to go check the circuit breaker and turn the power back on. Maddio, can you go do it? Wait, me? Why me, Luigi? Why can't you go do it? I mean, aren't you the one that always calls me scaredy cat? Clearly, I'm not fit for the job. <laughs> I guess you're right. I mean, I'm glad you finally acknowledged that. But Luigi, it's just a garage. I mean, we've been in there before. It's not scary. Come on, Maddio. Somebody's got to do it. Please, Maddio. Please go do it for me. Just do this one favor for me, please. Luigi, I've done a lot of favors for you. That's not your one favor. Maddio, just go check the circuit breaker, okay? Okay, fine, Luigi. Fine. I'll go do it just for you. Oh, thank you so much, Maddio. Oh, I really appreciate it. Oh, I didn't want to go in that garage. It's so dark and scary. Wow, Luigi. What a great person you are. Sending your brother into a room that you know is scary. Man. What a good person. Hey, Maddie, that's not what I meant. <sighs> well, hopefully he does it correctly. We really need this power to do this game night. <sighs> hey, Junior, where are you? I'm under the bed. Oh, what are you doing under there? Oh, you know, trying to start my new life under here. <sighs> I just don't get those guys sometimes. I mean, really? They always have to send me to do other dangerous tasks? Oh, my God, they would not stand a chance. Man, I'm so sick of them sometimes. I swear, if they were ever in a bad situation, oh, they would not make it. They would not. <laughs> ah, all right, garage time. Let's just get this over with already. Whoa, this place is really creepy at night. Why did it have to be me to do it? This is scary. But like Luigi said, somebody's got to do it. Don't know why it couldn't have been him. Don't know why it had to be me and me only, but I guess that's just how life be sometimes. Uh, so, where exactly is the circuit breaker? Okay, I gotta find it. It has to be somewhere around- Oh, there it is! Okay, I just gotta make my way over to that circuit breaker over there. Alright, let's just get over there. Alright, well, 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 circuit breaker. I finally made my way over here to you. Man, I haven't seen you in a long time. I mean, our power barely ever goes out, but I guess it's time for me to use you again. All right, let's see. Which switch turns the power back on? I think it's the one on the bottom. Well, oh, shoot! I actually got the power back on! All right, sweet. I knew I pressed the right switch. All right, now all I have to do is go back upstairs and have my game night with Junior and Luigi. Oh, man, it's gonna be so much fun. Oh, man, Luigi really sucks at video games, so I'm gonna pwn him. And Junior, well, well, you know what? He actually is a pretty even match. He's pretty good for his age. But still, though, I'm gonna totally whoop all their butts tonight. Uh... uh uh, hello? Can I help you? Uh, look, dude, I don't know who the heck you are or what you're doing in our garage, but get out of here, okay? We can call the police on you. You shouldn't be in here. Wait a minute. Why does he look so familiar? <gasps> oh, wait, you're Luigi's friend. How's it going, man? Yeah, I had a feeling you looked familiar. How have you been, man? It's been almost like, what, two years? I haven't seen you in a long time. Whoa, 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 dude. Is something wrong? Did I say something wrong? I'm sorry if I said something wrong, dude. I mean, I, I guess I'm calling you dude. You have a name, right? Your name is Red, I think, right? Okay, okay, Red. Well, look, I'm sorry if I did anything wrong, okay? I'm not really sure why you're, uh... uh what, are you, what, what are you doing with that knife? What are you doing with that? Wait, no! <laughs> Junior? Yeah. Well, it's been a while since the power came back on, but Matthew's not here. 
So? What do you mean, Soul Jr? We're supposed to have the game night together, you know? Like, it's supposed to be us three. We can't go without him. Hmm. What do you mean, huh? Why don't you care? Because, I mean, he always beats me, so maybe it'd be good to have a game night without him, you know? Maybe it'd be a lot better. Okay, look, Junior, he beats me too. I know how much it sucks to be beat, but we need him, okay? We're a trio. We never leave together, especially for game nights. Huh. Junior, come on! What do you mean by huh? Huh. Okay, you know what, Junior? We are going to go look for Mario together, okay? We're gonna do it together! <laughs> Junior, shut up! Look, Junior, we're gonna go find Mario whether you like it or not, okay? <laughs> but, but Luigi, I I'm cold, and I'm starving, and I'm hungry, and I- Junior, two of those words mean the same thing. You're not making sense. Look, Junior, we're just gonna go find Mario really quickly, and then we'll get right back to our game night, okay? It's gonna be a lot of fun. <laughs> okay, Luigi, but if he's not in the garage, then we have to have the game night anyway! <laughs> uh, uh yeah, sure, I guess. Oh, hopefully, Mario's in there. I don't know where the heck he is. What the heck? What the heck is that red button doing there on the table? I've never seen that before. Huh, I wonder what it does. Wait a minute, Luigi. Stop it! You're getting distracted. You have to go find Mario, okay? No one cares about stupid buttons. Go find Mario, Luigi. Ah, <laughs> alright, Junior. Let's hope Mario is somewhere in here. I mean, we know that he at least was in here, considering that the power's on, but... Wait a minute, why are the lights on in here? I mean, you know, there's a light switch here, so, you know, I mean, wouldn't he have turned that off if he left? So, he must still be in here somewhere. Uh, Luigi, I don't care, I just want to play games! Don't worry, Junior, it'll be quick, I promise! We're just gonna scan the area, and if he's not in here, then we can play the games, okay? Uh, I really hope you're telling the truth about that, Luigi. Well, oh, wait, there's a circuit breaker! Huh, yeah, there it is, and the door is wide open, which... It wasn't like that before, so at least we know that the circuit breaker did something, but why wouldn't he close it? Mm, I don't really know. That is kind of weird. M Mario! M Mario! Uh, please don't come out! I really want to play without you! Shut up, Junior! That's rude! M Mario! M Mario, what are you? Uh, come on, Mario! We need you for game night! We can't do it without you! Yes, we can! Shut up, Junior! M Mario! Come on! Is he no one around here? Uh, well, I guess not. I mean, I don't see a clue of him anywhere, so... Game night time? He has to be around here somewhere, right? I mean, all the clues point to the fact that he hasn't left the garage. Luigi, Luigi, Luigi. Game night time? <sighs> okay, you know what, Junior? Fine. Game night time. Without Maddie, I guess. Yes, 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 yes! Oh my god, I finally have a chance this time! Oh man, where could Mario be? He has to be around here somewhere. It's not like Mario to just disappear out of nowhere like that. Oh, something must have happened to him. Something really bad! I mean, he would have like called us or texted us by now or something like that, but just nothing. Uh, Junior, do you think we should call the police, you know, so they can get like a search on him and then we can find him? Luigi, even if we did call the police, everybody's asleep by now. So even if we started a search, then like nobody's awake to help us. So we might as well just like wait until tomorrow if we're gonna do anything like that. Come on, Luigi, let's just enjoy our game night and we'll worry about this in the morning, okay? Well, okay, I guess so, Junior. Maybe I am overreacting a little bit. All right, Junior, let's get to this game night. Oh, finally, this is gonna be fun. What the heck? What was that noise, Junior? Uh, I don't know. It kind of sounds like something fell downstairs. Do you think we should go check on it? Well, no, we're not going to check on it, Luigi. What kind of question is that? We're in the middle of game night. Come on, we have to focus. But, but what if it's Mario? Luigi, come on. I told you we're going to do that in the morning, okay? Just focus. <sighs> okay, I guess you're right, Junior. I guess I'm being a little paranoid over nothing. All right, let's get back to game night. <laughs> Okay, the fridge closing? Okay, that's definitely someone. I thought you said nobody was awake, Junior. I mean, that's what I thought, Luigi. I mean, it's the middle of the night. Nobody's came out to say we're being too loud. I think everyone's fast asleep. Well, clearly that's not the case if all these weird noises are coming from our kitchen. Come on, Junior. We gotta go make sure we're not getting robbed or something. Ugh, why are you being such a square, Luigi? Why can't you just play video games without all your constant paranoia getting in the way? Because clearly something's going on. Oh, 
o'clock, Luigi. This better be the last time we come back down here tonight, okay? This is getting ridiculous. Okay, okay, Junior, you'll win. It'll be the last time. I just swear that somebody's in this house judging by those noises. Well, if you insist, then I guess we can search one more time. Hmm, let's see. What clues could be in here? Uh, ooh, what the heck? What is that apple juice doing over there on the floor? Uh, apple juice? So what are you talking about, Luigi? Uh, Oh. <gasps> oh, wait, that's what that first noise was. It must have been this falling over. Yeah, I remember it standing up over there. So either somebody's in the house or it probably just fell down on its own. Well, do you see anybody down here, Junior? Uh, no, not really. Not that I can see of. Oh, dang it. I thought we were getting really close to cracking this case. Oh, man. Well, I guess we're gonna have to wait for something else to happen before we jump to more conclusions. Whatever. I'm not really all that interested in this mystery anyway. I just want to play some games. Hopefully it's not a robber or something. I swear, if somebody was to try and break into our house and steal all of our stuff, then I would, uh, I'd give them a knuckle sandwich, yeah. Luigi, you're the geekiest person I know. Nobody says knuckle sandwich anymore. Ah, oh, man, I need a snack. Huh? Oh, hey, Iggy, what are you doing up so late? Oh, hey, Luigi, hey, Junior. I was just getting up to get a midnight snack really quick. Oh, okay, that's cool. Oh, wait, 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 Iggy, I have something to tell you. Okay, so basically, earlier today, Mario went missing, so can you keep on the lookout for him in case you see him? Uh, Mario's missing? Yeah, can you help us, please? Uh, okay, I'll let you guys know if I see anything. Okay, thanks Iggy, we really appreciate it. Alright, Junior, let's get back to this lonely game night. You say that like it's a bad thing, Luigi. I've been beating you at every game. I'm having a ton of fun. Uh, okay, well, let's see what we've got in here. Just open the pantry. Okay, so we got, uh, what the heck? It doesn't seem like we have anything in here. I mean, we have some Cheerios, but I don't know how good that'll be. And then on the bottom, we got, like, I got some roasted peanuts, so those are okay. <laughs> whoa, 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 what the heck just happened? How did I get in here? Aw, where did my controller go? Junior, we're not even in front of the TV. Why would it matter where your controller is? Where did my controller go? Oh, come on, guys. I was trying to sleep. What do you guys want? Yeah, same here. Affirmative. Uh, I guess it has something to do with this button. I don't know. I didn't think it was going to do all this. I mean, I just accidentally landed on it, and then now we're all here. So, sorry, guys. Sorry for the inconvenience. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute, Iggy. I don't apologize. This is actually a good thing. Hi, right, guys. Now that we're all together, I can officially tell you guys my announcement. So, basically, earlier today, me and Junior noticed that Madio went missing after the power outage, and we don't really know where he went. I mean, there's not really many clues to where he could be. So, if you guys see him around the house or just anywhere, can you guys let us know? Ugh, dude, I have stuff to do in the morning. I really can't be up doing this, okay? Yeah, same for me. I gotta hit the gym at 5. You know how it is. Yeah, same. I gotta go to my clarinet lessons tomorrow. Shut the f*** up, Koopa. You don't play clarinet. Bro, why are you guys always like this? Just let me live. So, none of you guys are able to help tonight? Nope. nope. Alright then, I guess we'll just try this again tomorrow, or the next day, I don't know. Sorry for wasting your time, guys. Whatever. Peace. Well, back to sleep it is. See you guys later. Yeah, me too. I gotta get to my lessons. And yes, I actually do take lessons. I don't know why everyone thinks I lie about everything. I mean, I do, but I'm being serious this time. I'm really good. Sorry, guys. I gotta hit the hay. I mean, I was already asleep to begin with, so I gotta get back to that. So, I'll see you guys later. Hopefully, your search goes well. <sighs> Bye, Iggy. Oh, man, dude, you were never gonna find Magic this race. This is getting ridiculous. Well, I guess we're gonna have to just go back to our game night as usual then. That's completely fine by me! Finally time for Yoshi to head to sleep. Hi, my alarm is set for 3.30 a.m. And I'm ready for a good morning at the gym tomorrow. Haha, <laughs> yeah! I love gym Fridays. Alright, let's just get my beauty sleep. Uh, 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 hello? Uh, who are you? <gasps> Wait a minute, are you the Tooth Fairy? Well, actually, that'd be kind of unfortunate. I don't really have any teeth. But it's still nice to meet you, Tooth Fairy. Uh, the Tooth Fairy? Hello? <gasps> Wait, what? No!
Uh, Junior, did you hear that? That sounded like Yoshi. Who cares? He's fine. He's probably just having night terrors. Let's get back to our games, Luigi. Uh, no, Junior. That scream sounded a little too real. We're gonna have to go investigate. Oh my god! Why does all this crazy stuff have to happen on game night? All I want to do tonight is play some video games. I just really hope Yoshi's okay, Junior. Luigi, don't worry about it. He's fine. Yeah, but with a scream like that, you can't expect me not to worry. Yoshi! Yoshi, are you in here? Uh, oh, there you are, Yoshi. Hey, Yoshi, how's it going? So, uh, why exactly did you scream earlier? Yoshi? Y Yoshi! Luigi, come on, he's just sleeping. Let's go. It doesn't really seem like he's sleeping, though. I mean, I can't hear him sleeping. Luigi, it doesn't matter. Come on! No, no, no. I have to check on him. I have to check on Yoshi. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, Junior. Junior, this is really bad. Why, Luigi? Why? What happened now? Uh, uh, oh my god. Oh my god. That is really serious. Uh, oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. No. Ah! Uh, well, guys, I, I, I don't know how to, I, 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 I don't, I, I don't know how to, how to, 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 to tell you guys this, but, uh, but earlier today, I saw the- Bro, what? Spit it out already. <sighs> Just let me handle this, Luigi. Okay, so me and Luigi overheard Yoshi scream from the other room, so we went to go check it out, and when we went in there, he was dead. Like, completely stabbed up, you know, it was obviously a knife wound, not breathing, just dead. Completely dead. Uh, oh my god, he got stabbed with a knife?! Jesus, there really is some crazy stuff going on tonight, huh? Oh, man, I don't know if I'll be able to make it to my morning plans tomorrow. We're probably going to be up all night over this. Yeah, and that really suck. I'd hate to miss my lessons tomorrow. Koopa, I hope you die next. Everybody knows you don't take clarinet lessons. Bro, do you want to listen to me play clarinet? I can play clarinet, I promise. I can play, like, so many songs. Okay, then tell me one song that you can play. Uh, the Eiffel Tower? Yeah, you don't play clarinet. Dude! Guys, shut up! That's not important right now. There's clearly some kind of psycho murderer in the house, and we have to figure out who it is before he kills us all! And judging by the way that this button works, it seems like it teleports everyone in the house over here, so it must be one of us. So, who's the murderer? Well, he can already clear me, Luigi. I've been with you the whole night, so it couldn't have been me. What about you, Dad? Where have you been? Are you seriously calling me a murderer right now? No, I'm just asking you a simple question. Well, if you must know, I was in bed because I actually have stuff to do tomorrow, so it couldn't have been me. I have no reason to do that. If anything, you just suspect Koopa because he actually expects us to believe his stupid clarinet excuse. We all know he's got nothing going on. Okay, clearly nothing is going to convince you guys that I actually do play clarinet because you don't. Okay, look guys, you do realize how close I am with Yoshi, right? He's literally like my best friend. I mean, if I actually had to kill anybody in this house, he'd be like the last one on the list. I'm really close with him. Like, why would I kill him? Hmm, you know, you do raise a good point. It seems like everyone in this circle is pretty close with Yoshi, so you guys wouldn't have any motive to kill him. <gasps> Unless there's one person in this circle who I know isn't actually as close to Yoshi as we are, Iggy. What, me? Where did you get that from? Come on, Iggy. We all know how much you love hanging around Junior and how sometimes Junior likes to hang out with Yoshi instead. And sometimes that might make you a little jealous. And then you're like, oh, I hate Yoshi. He's taking my best friend away from... Oh, you guys are brothers. He's taking my brother away from me. Grr! And you finally were able to exact your revenge. And besides, where do you even sleep anyway? I mean, we all know where we sleep, but we don't know where you sleep. So you could have easily just ran in there and killed him. Okay, I'm not an emo middle score, okay? I'm not actually that clingy over my brother. And what does where I sleep have to do? Because everybody here sleeps in the same spot every night, including Yoshi. But you? We have no idea where you sleep, so it could easily be you. So, Iggy, I'm gonna ask you this once and one time only. Where do you sleep? Uh, well, to be honest, I sleep in a different spot every night, okay? I don't really know where I sleep. Yep, we got our answer. But just because I sleep in random spots doesn't make me a murderer! You guys suck so bad. So, so bad. Wait, so it wasn't him? He was literally my only suspect! So it's one of you guys then? Which one is it? <sighs> Calm down, Luigi. Look, I don't really think it's any of us. Clearly there's someone else in the house and this button is just faulty. Look, I'll just keep a lookout and let you guys know if I see or hear anything. <sighs> okay, Bowser. Thank you so much. That means a lot. Alright, Junior. Make sure you stick really closely with me, okay? We have to find out who this monster is, and we can't let him get one of us, okay? So just make sure you stick with me. Luigi, let go of me! No, Junior, we have to stay together. Like peanut butter and, uh, ham. Dude, what? 
Okay, I get the feeling that everyone's probably gonna die tonight. So if I'm gonna die, then I at least wanna die in my sleep so that I don't feel it and I don't know what happens. So yeah, I'm just gonna go do that. I'm just gonna go to bed. I don't care about this. Okay, time to plan out my deathbed. So if I'm gonna die tonight, then I wanna make sure it's as comfortable as possible. So I have to make sure that I'm fast asleep. So I'm gonna have to sleep on a cold surface. So that's usually how I fall asleep best. Okay, let me just, ah! oh my God. Oh my God, it's so cold, but it's perfect. That's exactly what I know. Oh, it's so cold. This is what I need. This is really what I need. Okay, let me just fall asleep like this. What the heck? Why the heck do I feel breathing on my neck? Uh, uh, Magus? What are you doing here? I haven't been a sussy little boy lately, have I? I am never saying that again. <gasps> whoa, 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 you're not supposed to do that yet. I'm not asleep. No, 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 stop. I'm not asleep. that is messing with the toilet. You're always supposed to flush it once. Oh, I swear, when I get my hands on this water-wasting frit, uh, uh, who the heck are you? Wait, no, 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 put that away, put that away! Uh, uh, am I the only person who just heard Bowser scream downstairs? No, I definitely heard that too. Should we go investigate? Yeah, yeah, we should definitely go investigate. I'm not even mad anymore. This is getting really scary. Yeah, I see what you mean, Junior. Okay, let's go downstairs and see what happened, Junior, okay? Hopefully Bowser's safe. Oh god, I really hope so. I don't even care about game night anymore. This is freaky! Bowser! Bowser, are you okay? Are you there, Bowser? Yeah, yeah, Dad. Are you good? Bowser! Bowser! Are you down here? Are you safe? Hey, where's the bathroom light on? I wonder what's going on in here! Oh, 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 what the fuck? Okay, I have absolutely no idea what the heck I just saw in there. Well, can you explain it? I can try. So I went into the bathroom, and then when I went in there, in the toilet was... Bowser and Koopa's corpses, and they were all bloody and stuff, and I, I, I don't know, it was just, why well, would somebody try to flush them down the toilet? Yeah, what made them think that a whole body was gonna fit down there? Exactly, Junior, that's what I'm saying. But, but wait, you're serious it was my dad? Uh-huh, it was Bowser. Uh, oh my god, so, so that means that my dad's dead? Uh, oh my god, Th that's just... Uh, uh. Okay, look, Luigi, I don't know why we didn't do this in the first place, but... I really think we should call the police, okay? I don't know why we didn't think of that earlier, but look, we're completely hopeless, okay? Because if Bowser can't get past him, like, Bowser's the biggest one we know. So if he can't get past him, then this is some really crazy murder. Some really skilled guy. So we're gonna need the police on our side, okay? Yeah, good idea, Junior. Let's get them over here. So you're telling me that there's a crazy murderer in your house, but you can't figure out who it is or where they are? So how do you even know they exist then? Because they've been killing our friends, and we keep finding their bodies scattered all around the house. So we meant to call you guys earlier, but we just didn't really think about it. Uh, I don't know, man. This kind of sounds like a self-report to me. You seem like you're acting a little bit among us tonight, you know? What? I mean, uh, look, okay, I don't know why you guys didn't call the police earlier, that's kind of weird, but I'm just gonna walk around the house, do my little investigation, I'll be able to find them for you guys, don't worry, just go chill somewhere, and I'll go find them, okay? Oh, okay, thank you, sir. Oh, man, hopefully this works. <sighs> man, Junior, it's really been a night, hasn't it? Well, yeah, obviously it's been a night, it's nighttime right now. Dude, that's not what I meant! How can you be sarcastic in a situation like this? Hmm, he has to have left some kind of evidence around. Oh my god! Which, Jesus, that's brutal! Well, we know we have a real one on our hands, that's for sure. Hmm. Nope, no one in here. They have to be somewhere. I mean, I know this is a big house, but they can't hide forever. There's not infinite hiding spots. Hmm, let's see. If I was a murderer, where in this house would I hide? Wait, what the hell? No! 
Oh my god. What happened? Julia, did you just hear the police officers scream? That means that this murderer is even capable of killing police officers. The people that are supposed to keep us safe. Oh man, Junior, we are no match for this murderer. We are next. Well, Junior, I guess, I guess these are our last minutes together. So we just have to... We have to stick together for as long as we can uh, till he gets one of us. It seems like we're doing pretty good so far. I mean, it seems like sticking together has been good. So we just have to stick together and hope that hope that we don't go our separate ways. And then he gets one of us and then he gets me. And then, oh my God. I think we'll be okay, Junior. Just let's stick it through. Well, if this really is goodbye, then I'm sorry, Luigi. I'm sorry for all the times that I called you stupid. I didn't mean it. It's okay, Junior. I'm also sorry for all the times that I put peanut butter in your mac and cheese cups as a prank. It's okay, Luigi. Wait, 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 wait. That was you? Dude, I thought I got food poisoning from that. Are you serious right now? Oh, Junior, what the heck happened to you? Uh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Th that's the murderer. Wait, what? Matthew? Is that really you? Or does it just look like you? What the heck is going on? Why do you look like that, Matthew? Or, or not, Matthew? What is going on? Wow! What are you doing to me? <laughs> no! No! You are not Matthew! I know that this isn't something Matthew would do! You're a phony! You get off our planet! <sighs> Man, that felt good. Wait, what? What the heck am I doing here? Oh, come on, what are you doing back here? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, I can finally breathe. Oh, my God, I'm finally out of that suit. Jesus, that was uncomfortable. I don't even know what happened! Oh, wait, Matthew, are you okay? Oh, thank goodness, Matthew, what happened to you? Wait, what? Oh my god, Red! Oh, I haven't seen you in so long! Wait a minute, Red, don't tell me you were a part of this! Oh yeah, so what? Uh, we snitched on you two years ago. It doesn't mean you can possess my body and stuff me in a suit! And maybe kill all my friends! Like, what kind of psychopath does that? Okay, you know what? I think I have a way to solve all of this. Well, Luigi, what's wrong? What's going on? <sighs> Matthew. Matthew, oh my god. What, Luigi? What? What's going on? Are you okay? Talk to me, Luigi. <sighs> Matthew. They, they finally built a 7-Eleven in our area. Uh, okay, and is that actually what you were freaking out about? Uh... Yep, that was it. Well, Luigi, don't do that! You made me think the house was on fire or something, and why does it even matter that there's a 7-Eleven in our area anyway? It's just a gas station, Luigi, who cares? No, 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 Matthew, you don't understand, because 7-Eleven has the... It has the... The Slurpee. Oh my god, the Slurpee is just so good. The way it's so juicy, you never know what you're gonna get. Oh, the way the amazing slushy goodness just hits your taste buds and melts on your face. And then it... Luigi, what are you talking about? You're not making any sense. Matthew, all I'm saying is it's a huge deal that there's a 7-Eleven here now, because now we can try the Slurpee. <laughs> so you believe that a 7-Eleven Slurpee is that unique, Luigi? Yes, Matthew, I do believe in that, because a 7-Eleven Slurpee is awesome. Okay then, well why don't you take my car keys and take yourself to 7-Eleven and why don't you get us a couple Slurpees and I'll let you know what I think of it. But I guarantee you, there is nothing unique about that 7-Eleven Slurp- <laughs> Jesus, he's fast. Well, nobody's here now and I'm all alone in this room and I have the computer, so uh...
I guess it's time to do what I usually do and know what's around. All right, okay, let's just, uh, let's just, okay, nobody's around. Okay, let me just uh, let's type in the secret website, and here we go. All right, it's time for a fun day. <laughs> oh my god, I think I'm finally here. I'm finally at the 7-Eleven. Oh my god, it's gonna be so awesome. I can't wait to go inside. But uh, this is a store, so I kind of have to contain my excitement, but oh my god, I can't wait to go inside. Oh my god, this has to be the coolest store ever! Oh, sorry, sorry. Okay, let's see what Slurpee I should get him. Okay, so we got- Wait a minute! Blue Raspberry is out, and so is Cherry! Those are like the only two flavors! Oh man, I don't know what to get him. I might as well just call him, I guess. <sighs> come on, Manuel, come on, answer! Oh my god! Oh, I am such a bad man! Oh, come on! Why is Luigi calling me? Not in the middle of this! <sighs> okay, you know what? I guess I can take a little break and answer him. Let's just see what he wants. <sighs> Hello? Oh, hey, man, yo, I'm at the 7-Eleven right now, but uh, a lot of the flavors are out, so do you want Coca-Cola? Or... Can I have cherry? Uh, no, man, yo, they don't have cherry. But do you want Coca-Cola or Mountain Dew or Peach Perfect or Pina Colada? Which one do you want? Okay, I don't know what any of these are. Mm, none of those really sound that appetizing to me. Uh, what about Blood Orange? Man, yo, they don't have that flavor here. But, but their website says they have it. Okay, but it doesn't apply to every location, okay? Can you just pick one of the ones I said? Aw, okay. I guess I'll just have to pick another one. Let's see. What else is on this path? Oh, what about Mango Lemonade? Okay, I give up. I'll just get a random one. Thanks, Matthew. Uh, thanks for nothing, I guess. <sighs> Wasting my time in the store? What is wrong with him? Uh, I guess I'll just get a Peach Perfect, because, you know, I mean, his girlfriend's named Peach, so I think he'll appreciate it. Alright, let's just... Let's just let's, uh, okay. Alright. Let's just... Let's do this. Then... There we go. Okay. Hopefully he likes this one. And done. Finally finished a drink. Okay, let me just call him and see if he's okay with it. Ugh. Oh, come on, Matthew. I always answer you quickly. Why don't you answer me? <laughs> I'm surprised this isn't a crime. Oh, come on. What does he want now? Hello? Oh, hey, Matthew. Are you fine with Peach? What? Peach? Why is that any of your business, Luigi? What? No, that's not even what I'm talking about. No, 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 no. I want you to answer me, Luigi. What makes you think it's okay for you to ask about me and Peach's relationship? I mean, I don't ask you about you and Daisy, so why are you asking me all this personal question? Okay, he's fine with it. I'm just gonna get this. Hmm... Maybe I can get something for myself, too. Okay, I'm finally done here. Now let's go home and finally prove Maddie wrong. I know the Slurpee is so much better than every other slushy. <laughs> ah, Alright, got my stuff, and now it's time to go home. I am such a bad man for being on here, especially for how long I've been on it, too. Oh my god, I'm such a menace. Who has even done this before? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, that's mad, y'all. I'm back. <laughs> uh, uh, hey, Luigi, uh, I wasn't doing anything on the computer. Don't question me. I didn't know you were going to be back so soon. Uh, okay. Wait, well, why do you look so out of breath? Did something happen? Uh, yeah, mad, y'all. It started raining on the way back, so I kind of had to rush it. Wait, did it actually rain outside? Whoa. It actually does look pretty bad out there. Okay, I see what you mean, Luigi. Anyways, where's that Slurpee you've been raving about, huh? I can't wait to prove you wrong! Oh, yeah, 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 you're Slurpee. Let me go get that for you. Alright, you do that! Oh my god, I can't believe I just finessed the free slushy out of Luigi. <laughs> He's such an idiot. Did I just say finesse? Jeez, I'm really turning into a high school girl, aren't I? <laughs> Alright, man, you here's your Slurpee, so I hope you enjoy. Well, wait a minute, Luigi, what happened to my Slurpee? Why does it look so melted? Oh, well, it's kind of a long way to the 7-Eleven, and it's also a long way back, so I guess it melted a bit on the way there, but it's still a little slushy, you know? Like, there's still a little bit in there, there's enough. Uh, I don't know, it looks more like juice to me, but, I mean, it really is the flavor that matters, so, you know, that's what determines if it's better or not, so, yeah, you know what, whatever. Thanks, Luigi. Thanks for the Slurpee. You're welcome, Maddie. I'll just leave it there for you whenever you want it. And I'll just take my Doritos with me. Wait, Doritos? Uh, can I have a Dorito, Luigi? Uh-huh. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. Uh, here you go, Maddie. Oh, oh, yeah, I'm gonna catch this in my mouth like a... Uh, that was not what I wanted to happen. Well, I gave you your free Dorito, your free Slurpee, so everything's all good now. So have a good day, Maddie. Okay, thanks, Luigi. You too. Wait, was this Doritos bag purple? What flavor is that? I gotta find out, I guess. Um, um, um.
Hmm, what flavor is this? Oh my god! Oh my god, this flavor is really hot! <laughs> okay, clearly Luigi just gave me a spicy chip. Why did he even have those? Like, why does he have spicy chips? Oh my god, and he especially fed it to me. Is he trying to kill me or something? Oh, wait, no, 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 I asked for those chips, so, you know, it's my fault. Oh my god, oh my god, I need to cool down, I need to cool down. Oh, uh, uh, wait a minute, my Slurpee. Oh my god, this is perfect! Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, okay. Okay, that hits the spot! Oh, I'm finally cooled down now. <sighs> Wait a minute. Wait. Oh, no, no, no! Now I'm cold! I didn't want to be cold! I just wanted to not be as hot anymore! <sighs> oh, no! Oh, come on! Why do I have to be cold now? Oh, what do I do? And now I have to eat something warm! Okay, uh, should I ask Luigi for more of those spicy Doritos again? But, wait, no, no, that's the whole reason I'm in this mess in the first place! I just have to eat something normal! Okay, not something spicy, but something warm! Okay, just something normal, warm, hot, whatever! I just need a normal drink, or food, I, I don't know, I just need something warm! Whoa, oh my god! Okay, I have to find something really quickly to warm myself up! I have to find something warm, but what? I have to find it quickly! Okay, I have to- uh, wait a minute, there's brownies right here! Oh yeah, brownies are always warm! Alright, I just gotta eat these brownies, and then I'll be good! Oh yeah, warm brownies hit the spa! Wait a minute, those brownies weren't warm, they were cold! Why would somebody leave cold brownies out here? Oh no, oh no, oh my god, oh no! Man, what a hot day outside. It's so sunny, so warm. Oh, the warm feels perfect on my skin. Oh man, I could be out here for hours and hours and that. Wait, what? Wait, what am I doing in a freezer? Oh my god, oh my god, get me out of here! Get me out of here! Uh, oh my god. I, uh, 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 uh. Oh man, the TV's boring today. Oh, I need something else to do. Hmm, what should I do now? Whoa, whoa. it's kind of late. I didn't even realize it. It's kind of dark outside. Huh, I guess I have to start heading to bed then. Uh, Madio! Madio, you coming to bed? M Madio? Huh, now that I think about it, I haven't seen him in a few hours. Where is he? Eh, oh well, I'm sure he'll turn up. He always does. I'll just go get a quick snack before bed. <laughs> Let's see what snack I can get. Oh, hey, Madio, I didn't know you were in here. So, uh, are you ready to come up to bed yet? <laughs> Madio? <laughs> are you sleeping already? Are you sleeping? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Jesus, Jesus, why are you so cold? <laughs> Madio? <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> oh my god, oh my god! Uh, Matthew, what's happened to you? Why do you look like that? And why are you so cold? Oh no, there must be something wrong with him. Matthew, answer me! M Matthew? Oh no, there must be something really wrong with him. But what? Okay, so he's cold, and there's something wrong with his face. But, but what could it be? Uh, 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 oh no. Oh no, no, don't tell me it's what I think it is! Oh no, don't tell me it's true! Oh no, I had to see it to believe it! The slurp is completely empty and Matthew's passed out and cold in the kitchen! Oh, that can only mean one thing. He must be having some kind of a reaction or a brain freeze! But how? I mean, slurpees don't just give you brain freezes if you drink them normally. How does that even work? Well, I did warn him the Slurpees were good, so maybe he's just having a reaction for how good it is. Wait a minute, now's not the time for jokes. What is wrong with me? How could this have happened? Oh no, it must have been from that spicy chip that I gave him. He must have drank his Slurpee too fast. Oh no, this is my own fault. I gave my brother a brain freeze. Oh. Okay, it's okay, Luigi. It's okay. This can all be solved. You just have to solve it yourself. Yes, yes. You just have to take matters into your own hands and save your brother. And nobody has to know except the- Oh, uh, hey, Luigi. We were just about to ask you about this. We were about to play some Mario Party in here, and then we saw that Mario has passed out cold on the stove. So, do you know what happened? Oh, wait. Why are you guys playing Mario Party in the kitchen? Uh, because it's game night with the boys, obviously. And we play wherever we want. So, we felt like the kitchen would be kind of like a fun location, you know? Like, we never played in here before. And it's kind of random, too. So, you know, it's just like a fun location. Yeah, but good thing you showed up. We were about to ask Mario, but we don't really know what's wrong with him. So, do you want to play? Uh, no, guys, no. I don't think it's time for games right now. Oh, come on, Luigi. It's always time for games. Yoshi, Yoshi, no. Listen to me. 
Guys, I think there's something seriously wrong with Madiel. I think he's going through an extreme brain freeze, and we need to help him get out of it. <gasps> oh, see, I thought it was a brain freeze from the beginning, but I've never really seen one as extreme as this, so I just kind of doubted it. Well, that's easy. I mean, all we have to do is just warm him up, and judging by the fact that he passed out next to brownies, he was probably already trying to do that to begin with, so all we really need to do is just warm him up somehow. Uh, okay, well, how do you suggest we do that, then? Hmm... Yoshi, this has to be the worst idea you've ever had. He's gonna explode from the heat. No, he won't, Luigi. It only happens in the movies. Look, if we just heat him up for like 10, 15, 20 seconds, then he should be good. He should be all warmed up and awake and well. Well, wait, so do we get to eat him? I call dibs on his nose. No, Bowser, that's for another day. All right, in you go, Mario. Okay, let's just heat him up for like 10, 15 seconds. There we go. He's done. All right, Mario, welcome back. Mario? Mario, welcome back, you know? Oh, shoot, it didn't work. How did it not work? How did he not explode everywhere either? Luigi, I already told you that doesn't happen, especially not for only 15 seconds. But we need a new plan. Do you guys have anything? No, I spent the whole time thinking about eating him. What about you, Junior? Well, we could always put him in hot water. Hmm, that's not too bad of an idea. Okay, everyone. Is everyone ready to watch Mario get dunked? Uh, I don't know, Yoshi. This idea seems kind of extreme. I mean, what if Mario is slightly conscious and he can feel the pain of the hot water? Oh, come on, Luigi. You think too much about people's feelings. We're literally saving his life right here. I doubt that he cares. All right, Mario, you ready? Mario, are you ready? Yoshi, he's passed out. Uh, hey, shut up, Junior. I knew that. Anyways, Mario, let go! <laughs> Feel the heat, Mario! Feel the warmth! Feel it deep in your pores! Do you feel it, Mario? Do you feel it? <sighs> okay! Alright! Mario? Oh, shoot! We really did that for nothing, guys! Well, Jesus, you psychopath! What the heck was all that about? Well, hey, I had to make it exaggerated. It's not entertaining otherwise. Anyways, guys, new plan. Well, we gotta try some spicy foods next and see how he reacts to those. Wait, the spicy foods? Well, Yoshi, no! Okay, I need some ideas, guys. What spicy foods do you guys think Mario would eat? We need to feed him something. Uh, what about Takis? I mean, we all like eating those. Yeah, Takis would work for sure. I know we have a bag somewhere in the pantry. Oh, or maybe we could do this in a different room. Yeah, this isn't really the best room to do it. I mean, you know, it's all blue and yellow and, you know, it's just not really the best room, guys. Well, what are you talking about, Luigi? There's nothing wrong with this room. Uh, uh, oh, shoot. We ever tested right here some spicy sweet chili dorito actually it's sweet spicy chili N no bowser it literally says spicy sweet chili on the bag right there well, wait it does oh that's stupid it should be called sweet spicy chili it rolls off the tongue better i don't know bowser i didn't make the chip anyways guys we should probably feed him this it's the closest thing we have wait why are there spicy doritos in my room i didn't bring those here yeah neither did i and now that i think about it luigi you were the one with the spicy chips earlier what were you doing with those oh well uh, he you know i just wanted to give myself a little spice you know just give myself a little kick you know <laughs> all fun and games so then why exactly were you so against us coming in here when there's just chips in here are you hiding something luigi what no 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 no, yoshi i'm not covering anything up i promise luigi you make it really obvious when you're lying every time you lie a hole opens up in your leg junior the hole has always been there and don't talk about it i'm insecure about it <laughs> okay all right guys i'm gonna tell you something that you can't tell anybody else okay I think I'm the reason that Mario had the brain freeze. But wait, what? Look, guys, what I think happened is that I gave Mario a spicy chip, and then he drank a Slurpee too quickly, and then he just passed out in the kitchen. I don't know, guys, okay? It's out of my fault. Wait, all you did was give him a spicy chip? Well, that's not your fault, Luigi. It's Mario's fault for being an idiot and drinking a Slurpee too quickly, not expecting a brain freeze. Anyways, guys, let's try to feed him this chip. <laughs> wait, so you're telling me it's not my fault? No, Luigi, it's not your fault. All right, Mario, eat this. Mario, eat it. Mario, eat it. Come on. Come on, man. S save your own life. Oh, shoot. I just realized, since he's not conscious enough to actually move anything in his body, he, he can't really chew or digest this chip anyway. And if it actually went down his throat, then that would just make him choke and die. So, well, guys... Looks like there's nothing we can do. What should we do now? Why don't we try putting him in the air fryer? No, we already tried the microwave, so the air fryer wouldn't do anything. And the oven wouldn't work either, so nobody suggests that. Well, hey, Yoshi, what about the oven? 
Okay, well, since nobody actually wants to work seriously, how about this? We've tried our best tonight. We're gonna give this a rest. We're gonna try things again in a couple days. If he's not okay in a couple days, then we're gonna try some new strategies. And yeah, we're just gonna give him a rest. We're just gonna leave him there and wait until he comes back. Well, leave him there? Well, Yoshi, this is my room. I don't want his creepy corpse sitting here. I know where to put him instead. He should cool down in there. Well, wherever you put him, that won't affect his recovery. I'm gonna go watch Animal Planet. Wow! Hopefully, Maddie will be okay. <laughs> what the heck? Wait, is that an ice cube? Who threw an ice cube at me? Luigi, nobody threw an ice cube at you. Yes, they did, Junior. Look, there's an ice cube right there. Uh, oh, somebody did throw an ice cube at you. Well, who did it then? I don't know. That's what I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> okay, somebody's definitely throwing ice cubes at me. Who is it? Uh, <sighs> Hey guys, what's going on? Madio, you back? You bet your sweet bippy I am. And I got some pretty sweet superpowers with it too. Oh man, you won't believe what a brain freeze does. Uh, actually, guys, a brain freeze doesn't actually do this to you. So like, like don't attempt this at home. Or if you're going to, then, then don't blame it on us. But I got some pretty cool ice powers. You want to see them? Eh, no, I think we can already figure it out. So you can shoot ice blocks? Yup, wherever I want, whenever I want. It's a pretty awesome power. Huh, well, that's cool, I guess. It's good to see you back, Mario. I completely agree, Luigi. Now, if you don't mind me, I'm going to go play with my brand new ice powers. Junior, am I the only person that thinks Maddio's ice powers might be a really bad idea? Uh, I mean, all you can really do is shoot ice blocks. It's annoying, but I don't really think it's going to do anything destructive. Oh my god, these powers are just so cool! I mean, I can shoot ice wherever I want! Uh, oh my god, these powers are so cool! I can shoot ice! I mean, who else do you know with ice powers? Oh my god, this has to be the coolest power ever! I mean, it doesn't really do anything, but... I mean, you don't know anyone else with ice powers, so... You know, I have my own unique ability! I'll find some kind of use for it someday. Oh man, this is cool. Hey, you know what? I think I'm gonna call some of my friends over and show them. Yeah, they have to know about my ice powers. All right, let me just call one of them right now. Wait a minute. Where's my phone? And what is this piece of ice doing here? Did somebody move my phone? Is it over here? Uh, no, it's not over there. Wait, where's my phone? Did, did I just... Wait a minute. I just touched my phone and now there's just a piece of ice here, so... <gasps> Oh my god, I think everything I touch turns into ice! That's so cool! But, wait, no, that's not cool, because now I don't have my phone! Oh god, oh god, I have to get my powers fixed! Luigi! Luigi! Luigi, you have to help me! <laughs> oh no, I turned the door into ice too! Oh god, oh, Luigi, you have to help me! If I was a sea creature, which one do you think I look the most like? Mm, a blobfish? I'm gonna kill you, Junior! How could you say that about my precious look? Oh my god, Luigi, you have to help me, please! Oh no, what did I do? Oh wow, thanks a lot, Mario, you show off. Junior, I didn't mean to do that, and that's exactly why I came in here. That's why you came in here, to turn Luigi into an ice cube? Wow, that's really mature, Mario. No, no Junior, it's not what you think. I didn't want this to happen. That's why I'm coming in here, because I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Huh, you know, I think I kind of like being an ice cube, actually. Thanks, Mario. Wait, he's still alive? Oh, thank God, I thought you killed him, Mario. Nah, no, I'm not dead. I mean, it is a little chilly in here, but I'm fine, I can manage it. I've never seen the world like this before. This is cool. Okay, so you have more than just the ice shooting power. You have the ability to turn whatever you want into ice? Uh, apparently, I had no idea until I went to go grab my phone and then poof, just turn into ice. That's really weird. So how do you think we're going to fix it? Uh, I don't know. That's what I'm trying to figure out. I don't even know if this is fixable, but you know, it's good to try. So what do you think? Hmm. Well... And that's why you guys have to give me $7 million in damages. You guys have caused so much of my life already and just, uh, I need the $7 million, okay? It's the only way that I'm going to calm down about this. Sir, we literally just opened our location a couple of days ago. There's no way that you already want to sue, and there's no way that any of that happened. Well, it did, so are you gonna pay up, or are we gonna have to take this to court? <sighs> I don't have time for this. Next caller. Wait, what? Hello? Hello? Oh my god, they hung up on me! Oh, now I'm really gonna take it to court. <sighs> hey, wait a minute. How come when I touched your phone, it didn't turn into ice? <laughs> Oh, shoot. Oh, wow. Thanks, Mario. That really helps me a lot. Well, I'm sorry, Junior. I didn't think some random god up there was listening to me say that and then just decided to make my karma come back to me. Oh, my god. What am I supposed to do? W w wait a minute. G god. W hey, Mario, that might be it. No, Junior. I'm not going to pray to god about some stupid ice problem. He's not going to care. No, 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 no. Not actual god. You know, like, there's all the little mini gods, you know? So why don't you try praying to, like, uh, what's the closest thing to this? Uh, Poseidon, you know? Like, Poseidon's the water god. And ice is frozen water. Junior, that's genius. Okay, I could try that. All right, let me just try and pray to Poseidon. Okay, let me just get in, like, the, like, the prayer position. Okay. All right. Poseidon, 
I need your help today. I know this doesn't exactly have everything to do with you, but I, I just need a miracle today, okay? I need you to help me with my problem. Unfortunately, I've been dealt with a very, very, very unfortunate circumstance. Everything I touch turns into ice. You know, that kind of sounds like a Minecraft video title. Shut up, Junior! Okay. Poseidon, I'm gonna need you to help me with this, okay? I know you don't have everything to do with this, but hopefully you can give me something. Just please, just please reverse whatever happened to me. If you're able to find out whatever happened, reverse it, or at least just, you know, make it to where everything I touch just turns into, I don't know, whatever it is before. You know, just, just make, reverse my thing, okay? Thank you. Thank you so much. Mario. Well, Poseidon, is that you? Yes, that's me, Mario. I have come to inform you that your wish has been granted. Wait, it has? Yes, it has been dealt with by the proper gods. <sighs> Junior, what the hell is wrong with you? Well, it's not my fault that you were praying to Poseidon incorrectly. I had to improvise. Oh, well, I had a feeling I wasn't doing that properly anyway. <sighs> So, should we just go back to Luigi and see if he knows anything since, you know, he is an Ice Cube, so maybe he'll know something. Oh uh, yeah, we could do that. I'm surprised we didn't think of that in the first place. Alright, Mario, let's go talk to Luigi. Alright, Luigi, we need your opinion on something. We're trying to figure out how to... Uh, Luigi? L Luigi, are you there? <gasps> uh, oh my god. Oh my god, no, this isn't good! Mario! What? What's wrong, Junior? W Wait a minute. No, 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 don't tell me that's Luigi, Junior. <sighs> I'm afraid it is, Mario. Oh, come on, really? I knew this was gonna happen. Well, you knew this was gonna happen? So then why did you do anything about it? Well, I didn't think it was gonna melt that quickly. Oh my god, this just turned into a whole nightmare. Oh, this is such a mess. What am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to reverse all this? <gasps> Wait a minute. Th this all started when I got that brain freeze, right? So... I guess all I have to do is figure out how to reverse that! Alright, Junior, how are we supposed to reverse a brain freeze? Hmm, well, how'd you get the brain freeze in the first place? Well, from what I remember, Luigi gave me these really spicy chips, and they were really hot. So I went to go drink my 7-Eleven Slurpee, and it was really cold. So then I went to go eat some brownies, thinking they were hot, and then they were cold. So, you know, I just passed out from hypothermia, or whatever the heck it was. So, why are you asking me this? Why is this important? Well, then why don't we reverse the equation? I mean, you ate those spicy chips, and then you went to go drink the Slurpees. So, why don't we do it in reverse, and you just go eat those hot chips then? Where'd Luigi leave the chips? Oh, no. No, 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 he finished those. It's been a few days, so he definitely doesn't have those anymore. <gasps> but we could improvise. We have some hot stuff at the house, so yeah, let's just go in the kitchen and find something hot to eat. Or drink. I don't know. Anything works, really. All right, Mario. Hopefully Mario's idea works. You'll be back soon, Luigi. Don't worry about it. Hmm. Okay, I think I've got it now. Hopefully this works. Let me just take this to Mario. Okay, Mario, let's end off this brain freeze disaster. I've got here some coffee. Uh, Junior, that looks absolutely disgusting. What kind of coffee is that? What do you mean, Mario? It's my own homemade recipe. I thought you'd like it. A homemade recipe? Yeah, that doesn't really make things any better. If anything, it sounds kind of worse. Is it at least hot enough like we want it to be? Uh, it should be. All right, Mario, let's do this. All right, there we go, Mario. There is your coffee. <laughs> okay, I really wish I could just black out right now and not have to drink this. So what are the rules for this, Junior? What, what rules? Uh, oh, yeah, right, 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 right. So I don't think you actually have to touch the cup with your hands. I think you can just kind of use your mouth on the top. So, yeah, just do it like that. So don't touch the cup, Mario. All right, got it, Junior. Don't touch the cup. Don't touch the cup. Don't touch the... <laughs> uh... uh, uh... Ah! Don't touch the cup. Don't touch the cup. <sighs> <laughs> oh my god. I want to get my stomach pumped out now. That was... Jesus, that was the worst thing I've ever had in my life. <sighs> Wait a minute. Uh, I, I just touched the table and it didn't turn into ice. Uh, no way! This garbage actually... I mean, uh, this original recipe actually worked? I mean, all that really mattered was that it could cool down my body temperature. So, yeah, it clearly worked. Oh, that's awesome! Yay! We fixed the world! Hey guys, what's going on in here? Oh, hey Luigi, I see you're not in Ice Cube anymore? Huh, Mario, I guess we reversed everything then. Huh, double yay, this is awesome. Yeah, but he seems a little off though. Are you okay, Luigi? Oh, oh me? Uh, yes, yes, Junior, I'm doing absolutely perfect, but I'm just feeling a little cold, that's all. I mean, I was just an Ice Cube after all. Uh, oh no, Mario, I think you made a big mistake turning him into an Ice Cube. Yeah, it does seem like that. So I guess we have to feed him this weird coffee stuff as well. So uh, Luigi, don't touch anything. Just come over here and we'll give you some coffee. What? What do you mean, don't touch anything? Wait, what? 
What am I? What is everything? What? Oh my god, this has to be the coolest toy ever! Oh my god, I love you, Swimmer Rabbit! I don't know why you have a car tire around you, but I guess that's just your unique style! Oh my god, you're so awesome, you know, with your little goggles and your car tire. Are oh, you so cool? You're the coolest toy ever! Uh, Junior, can you keep it down? I can't really hear the TV. Uh, no, maybe you could go to a different room to watch TV, because I'm trying to play with my toy in here. Uh, or you could go to a different room to play with your toy. Are we seriously making this to the bay? I just asked you to lower your volume. Well, I don't think that's what Swimmer Rabbit wants, right, Swimmer Rabbit? Yeah, you want to stay right here and not listen to the those big bad adults. So swimmer Rabbit? I don't care what Swimmer Rabbit has to say. It's just a stupid toy. Who cares? <gasps> you called Swimmer Rabbit a stupid toy? Uh... Yeah, because that's literally what he is. He's just a stupid toy. Uh, oh, oh my god! I just, I can't believe you would say that about him. Just, uh, oh my god! We are out of here. Come with me. Nah, uh, oh, we are having none of this. Okay, yeah, Bowser needs to take that kid to a psychiatrist sometimes. He's been really weird recently. What is his issue? That hater! I can't believe him! I mean, who does he think he is talking to you like that? Oh, don't you worry, Swimmer Rabbit. I'll make sure he never talks about you like that again. You hear me? By doing my secret spell. All right, Swimmer Rabbit, you ready? I'm about to launch the ultimate curse on Mario. <sighs> okay, here we go. Heard at least. I don't know this. Man, now, but I want to matter now. Weeping out people now. No. Eat egg of snail, plus not snail, one and we. Snail, snail, is not written. Okay. Hopefully he'll learn. Now, we just have to wait until tomorrow, and he'll learn his lesson. Oh, he will! <sighs> okay, it's getting kind of late. I think it's time to hit the hay and see what tomorrow brings me. Oh, going to bed so soon, Mario? I don't think that'll do you any favors. Uh... What? Uh, nothing, nothing, Mario. I'm just messing with you. So, uh, what do you plan on doing tomorrow? Tomorrow? Uh, I don't really know yet, because it's not tomorrow yet, so once it's tomorrow, then I'll figure out what happens. Oh, is that so? Well, he'll definitely figure it out then, one way or another. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> nothing, nothing, Mario. Come on, what are you so paranoid about? I'm just messing with you. Anyways, Mario, I hope you have a very pleasant day tomorrow. Good night! What the heck is wrong with him? He's being really weird. Uh, oh well, I'm just gonna go to sleep and try to forget about it. Alright, good night, world! Wait, I forgot to turn off the lights. Of course Junior didn't turn them off for me. Typical. <sighs> okay, let's catch some Z's. Good night, world! <sighs> wait, what? Okay, wait a minute. This is definitely not my body. What is this? Why do I look like this? Like, I feel all weird and metallic, like like some kind of robot. And why do I sound like a robot too? Oh my god, okay. I definitely turned into something. I don't know what it is or how it happened, but oh well. I guess I'm just gonna start on my day and figure it out later. <laughs> why am I walking like this? It's so... <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Okay, I've definitely turned into some kind of like robotic toy of some sorts, but how? This is so weird. Okay, let me try to get some answers. Maybe I can ask Junior. Yeah, he seems to know a lot about toys. Okay, let me just go ask him. Oh my god, I'm never gonna get used to this walking. Junior, help! Junior, please help me! Oh my god, Mario! You don't look so good! What the heck happened to you? Ugh, I wish I could tell you, Junior. I just woke up, and I suddenly look like this! I look like some kind of robot toy thing! And the only way I can walk is in this weird, straightforward, robotic motion. Like, you know, my legs just move up and down. It's so weird. I don't get it, Junior, okay? Like, why did I wake up like this? Do you know anything? Uh, no, no, I don't know anything, Mario. Do you know anything, Swimmer Rabbit? No, Swimming Rabbit doesn't know anything either, so, uh, we don't have anything for you, bye. Uh, are you sure? I mean, I don't know how I could have woken up like this. I just went to sleep, woke up, and now I'm suddenly looking at a toy! Look, Mario, I have absolutely no idea what the heck you're talking about. I mean, how do you think I could have been behind this anyway, huh? Well, why are you trying to blame me? No, I was just saying... <sighs> okay, you know what? You might be right. I mean, I don't think you're smart enough to pull off all this, so... I guess I shouldn't have blamed you. I'm just asking you because you're the last person I talked to last night before all this happened, so... I don't know, I'm just asking all the witnesses, I guess, but... Alright, Junior, I'll leave you alone. See you later. Oh my god, it's so weird walking this way. Phew, 
Oh man, that was a close call. For a second there, I thought he knew. But at least he can finally learn his lesson. Isn't that right, Slimmer Rabbit? Yeah, we just had to show him who's boss. Man, the power of toys, the power of toys. <sighs> Hopefully he learns his lesson. Well, I'm running out of options. I mean, if Junior the toy expert doesn't know, then who else am I supposed to ask? I mean, it's not like I'm gonna go ask somebody like Louise. Hey, Maddio, good to see you today. Whoa, M Maddio, what the heck happened to you? You look so cool. Wait, cool? You think I look cool? You really think so? Y yeah, dude, you look all cool and clean and shiny. Just look at you. <laughs> well, I guess I am looking beautiful as always. But no, actually, Luigi, I don't really like it like this. I mean, it's really hard to walk around like this. I like being a wind-up toy. Oh, well, I'm sorry to hear that, Maddio. But if you're a toy now, then <gasps> I can finally do what I've always wanted to do. <laughs> what? What you've always wanted to do? What would that be? <laughs> oh boy, Maddio, this isn't going to be easy. Wh what? No, come on, Peach, give me another chance, please. No, Mario, I can't believe that you will cheat on me with, with Daisy. Oh, come on, Peach, don't you know how much better of a princess Daisy is? I mean, Luigi really is a lucky man. Come on, you know I couldn't resist. No, Mario, I'm leaving, goodbye. Oh, 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 oh come on, oh, my life sucks. Oh, oh. Huh, you know, I feel really good about my life choices right now. Life is good. What the hell was that? That didn't even make any sense. I mean, Luigi, how are you a lucky man if Daisy cheated on you? Ugh, okay, you know what? Never mind. That was just so weird, Luigi. What is wrong with you? Eh, I don't know. I just kind of thought it'd be a funny idea. Anyways, I gotta go. See ya, Maddio. That's all he wanted to do? That's what he wanted to do this whole time? Oh my god. He really has no life goals, does he? Where's he gonna be in life? My heart will go on and on. Do -do. Dude, what the f*** are you doing? Ah, uh, hey! Uh, hey. So, Junior, I was actually coming in here to tell you about something funny I saw. Oh, you saw something funny? Okay, then hit me. Uh, okay. Ah, no, I meant hit me, like, hit me with the info, tell me! Uh, oh, okay, sorry, I don't really understand all this new youngster snap. Okay, anyways, okay, so basically, I was in the hallway, and I actually was just with Maddio a second ago, and he literally turned into an action figure, like a full-on wind-up toy, it's freaking crazy, have you seen it? Uh, no, no, I haven't seen it, what, what toy Mario? I don't, I don't know anything about it, Luigi, so, uh, yeah, bye, I don't think I want to see that. Uh, oh, I mean, I thought it'd be something that you'll be interested in, because, like, it's literally Maddio turned into a fully-fledged toy. Toy. Like, it's crazy! Oh man, only in our house does crazy stuff like this happen. I mean, you sure you don't know anything about it? I mean, you should go see it. No, Luigi, I don't know anything about it. I don't know how it could have happened, okay? Why do you keep trying to blame me, Luigi? I don't have anything to do with it. Why are you blaming me? But blaming you? Junior, I'm just trying to tell you about something that I saw. Oh my god, Luigi, you're putting me under a lot of pressure. I really think you should leave, okay? I have nothing to do with this! Jesus Christ, okay! Oh my god, what has gone into him? Why is he acting all crazy like this? Oh man, okay, now that was an even closer one than last time. Oh, I can't have anyone knowing that I'm the one behind this. Oh my god, okay. I just have to make it through the day, and you know what? I'm gonna turn Mario back to normal within like, I don't know, like a couple days, because I can't have people finding this out. Oh man, oh my god. Well, I guess Junior's gone completely crazy. What has gotten into him today? Oh, you're telling me? Earlier today, I tried asking him why I turned into a toy, and he just like freaked out on me. Yeah, that's exactly what he did to me too. He's been so weird today. Anyways, did you figure out how to get back to your original body? Uh, I mean, no. I think it's kind of obvious. See, I'm still obviously a toy. Wait, what's that? What's what? What are you talking about? That thing on your back. What is that? Uh, huh? Oh, this thing? Oh, I don't really know. I think it's like my wind-up crank or something. Cause I think I'm supposed to be a wind-up toy. <gasps> no way! That's so cool, man. You, you like a real wind-up toy. Oh, I want to play. Uh, I mean, I guess we could try it and see if it works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's try that. Okay, now let's see. Okay, so this is your wind-up crank. Okay, let me just Twist it, twist it, keep twisting it. Luigi, are you sure it's a good idea to twist it this much? Well, we have to see if it works, right? Okay, keep twisting and go! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, Luigi! Luigi, I can't control myself! No way! That's so cool! Uh, I mean, I guess, but I can't see much good coming out about this. I can't even move myself! I'm moving on my own! Well, it's still cool to know that you're like a real wind-up toy. Anyways, Mad, yo, I'm gonna go play some video games, so I'll see you later! Oh, I wanna play video games, too! And I'm stuck in this stupid wind-up sequence. Whoa! Whoa, wait, wait, I just bounced off the wall. Wait, no, 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 Luigi! Luigi, help me out! 
heck is happening out here? Maybe Luigi was right. I guess some weird stuff really does happen in our house. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Mario? Mario, are you good? Mario? Oh no, I think somebody broke him. That's not what I wanted. I just wanted to teach him a lesson. Now he's probably dead. Oh no, I have to hide him. Okay, come on, Mario. You come with me. Nobody has to know. Nobody has to know about this. <sighs> okay, you just gotta throw him in here and then close the door and no one will ever have to know. Not a single soul. <sighs> okay, time to just, just continue going about my day. Just keep going about your day, Junior. Nothing ever happened. Nothing happened here. Okay, Junior, you ready to go to bed? Uh, you bet I am, Dad. Oh, I can't wait to go to sleep and have some awesome dreams. Hopefully that creepy guy from 7-Eleven won't be in them, though. What? What the hell are you talking about, Junior? Hey, why is my heart in here? Uh, what was that noise? Uh, I'm sure it's nothing, Dad. Yeah, it's probably just the house settling, you know? Mm, you know, that might be true, Junior. This house is getting a little old. Okay, yeah, that's definitely not the house settling, Junior. It sounds like it's coming from your closet. I'm gonna go check really quick, okay? <gasps> oh, no! He's gonna see Mario! What is going on in there? Well, uh, that won't be necessary, Daddy. Yeah, yeah, you don't need to go in there. Uh, huh? Why not, Junior? Oh, my God, are you hiding something from me? Uh, well, the thing is... Uh, uh, okay, fine, Dad. You got me. I am hiding something. The truth is... I have 31 tarantulas in my closet. I'm keeping them as pets. What? What the hell? What is wrong with you, Junior? Why do you have all those? Yeah, see, that's why I don't even think you should try to go into my closet. Well, okay, well, I'm definitely not going in there now, now that I know that. I'll just see you tomorrow, Junior. Good night, you weird psychopath. Good night, Dad! I'm not your dad anymore. Oh, wow. I can't believe that actually worked. All right, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to wait till the morning to figure out how to fix Toy Mario. Thankfully, nobody's found out yet. Uh, what? I can't see anything. Oh my god, he's still going! Shut up, Mario! I'm trying to sleep! Uh, I'm trying to sleep, man! Wait a minute. I just realized that he's probably gonna go on all night like this. Okay, I have to figure out something. So, how do I shut him up? <gasps> Wait a minute! He must have batteries! Yeah, I was gonna go take out his batteries! There you are! And let me just take them out. There we go, I got his batteries out. Okay, now all I have to do is just put Toy Mario back in the closet. <sighs> See you tomorrow. Good morning, USA! <laughs> I've always wanted to do that. Anyways, good morning, Junior. Uh, what? Uh, good morning, Dad. Thanks for that wake-up, I guess. Oh, of course, buddy. Don't mention- Whoa! 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 What the heck did I just slip on? Wait, what are these doing in your room? Junior, why do you have batteries in here? The battery? Oh, no, 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 no! Don't touch those, Dad! Uh, why? I was just gonna go put them back in the battery cabinet. You don't have a reason to have batteries. And you shouldn't even have them in the first place! They're dangerous! I mean, they taste really bad. So, like, you know, I'm just gonna go put these back, okay? Well, no, 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 Dad! You cannot take those batteries! Why not? <sighs> okay, Dad. The thing is, is that... All those tarantulas in my closet, they have souls too, right? So they get bored as well, and they need some entertainment. So I need those batteries to power the TV they have in there. Well, wait, you're telling me spiders watch TV? Yeah, you'd be surprised. Okay, well, I don't want anything to do with those spiders, so there you go, Junior. Have your weird batteries or whatever. I don't know why you even have all those tarantulas in the first place. You're weird. Whatever, Dad. See you later. Okay, time to figure out how to fix Toy Mario. Ugh. Hmm, how am I gonna fix you? What, what the heck is going on? Wait, 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 what am I doing, doing here? here? What is all the business? Hey, Junior, what's going on? <sighs> I guess I have a lot of work to do. Ow! Oh, man, that's the most technical thing I could think of! Well, time for all my stupid solutions then. Uh, here's $10,000. You happy? Uh, I don't know what this is. Oh, really? Oh, he's so ungrateful. This doesn't really make sense, but what else can I do? <laughs> what, n nothing? Man, I was expecting a lot more than that. 
Oh well, I guess it's time for my last resort. Well, I was gonna wait until you were fully fixed to do this, but I guess I'm just gonna have to take the risk and see if it works. Okay, I'm gonna do my spell to turn you back into a human. Okay, let's do this. Ah. What? what the heck is happening? I don't know what's going on. What? Wait, wait, what? What the heck is that? That's not what I wanted. Luigi, help me! Luigi, please help me! Oh, no, 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 don't leave! I can't have anybody finding out about you! Oh no, everyone's gonna know! Uh, Bowser, I think there's something behind your nose. Wait, wait what? Wait, oh, wait a minute, but behind my nose? What the hell? What does that even mean? Mm, I don't know. I'm just seeing something behind your nose. I think you should go get that checked out. Yeah, I still don't know what joke you're trying to make. <laughs> hey, hey, Luigi, can you help me out with something? What the heck? What the heck is that? Uh, I have no idea. Well, uh, hey guys, enough to see here, so uh, just get out of here. Whoa, whoa, what? What did you do that for, Junior? Hey guys, guys, I'm just saying, you should get out of here right now. And what are you talking about? I didn't do anything. I didn't throw anything. That was just nothing. That was a, that was an air particle, you know? I had to, I had to throw an air particle. Okay, Junior, you really seem like you're hiding something from us. You've been really weird the past couple days. Yeah, Bowser's right. I've been kind of noticing that, too. What are you doing, Junior? Nothing, guys, nothing. I seriously have no affiliation with whatever goofy moments have happened today. Nope, not me. Hey, man, what's the big idea? Why'd you throw me? Well, uh, hey, shut up. You're supposed to be back in my room. I'm supposed to fix you. F fix him? What? Where did you hear that from, Luigi? Why are you so obsessed with spreading false accusations? Junior, I know when you're lying, and I think everyone else knows when you're lying, too. You're making it way more obvious than it should be. Yeah, Junior, I think we'd rather actually know what's going on than watch you keep on performing the circus act. Well, well it, it's just... It, uh, <sighs> okay, guys, fine. This originally started where I turned Mario into a toy, and then I tried turning him back, but, you know, since he was broken, he turned into this. Well, you're the one who turned Matthew into a toy? Can you do that for me, too? That's kind of cool. Uh, after all this, I don't think so. This is way too stressful of a situation. <gasps> oh, that's what all those sounds from your closets were. What kind of lie was Tarantula? Uh, I don't know. It was the quickest lie I could think of. Anyways, look, I already know what I did, okay? I don't need a lecture from you guys. We just need to figure out how to fix Mario. That's the most important thing. Uh, well, if we're gonna do that, then we're probably gonna want to turn him back into a toy. I mean, it's obviously a lot easier to operate on a toy than a human. Uh, yeah, that makes a little more sense. Okay, let me perform my spell again. <gasps> Hey guys, uh, how are you guys doing? Well, oh man, he's broken! D dude, we already knew this, so how are we gonna fix him then? I don't know, I already tried everything in the book, nothing works! Well, I mean, we could call a mechanic and they could do it for us. Okay, what is it with us not coming up with that stuff? It seems like the easiest solution. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna go look for the cheapest mechanic I can find. Uh, okay, sounds good. I'm so sick of dealing with glitchy Mario. I mean, listen to him. What do you mean you're sick of me? Don't talk about me like that. See what I mean? Oh, thank you so much for coming on short notice. Oh, we really needed this right now. What? Seriously, it's you? Luigi, you called this guy over? Oh, well, as long as you can do it, then just come on in. They called me over in the middle of the night again. I swear, if this isn't a quick job, I'm stealing their PS3. Okay, let's get this over with. Just show me what I'm working on. Wait, who the hell was this guy? So, Luigi, cheapest mechanic, huh? Well, it didn't sound like him on the phone. I didn't know. Anyways, dude, we need you to fix this toy. Oh, yeah, I should be able to do that. That's not that hard. What's the issue with it? Well, from what I saw, he fell down the stairs, so he has a lot of this weird glitchy damage. So, we just need you to fix him, whatever's wrong with him. Uh, I mean, that's not that specific, but I guess I could try it as long as you guys give me your- You're not getting our PS! PS3 just fixed the dang toy. Okay, okay, okay. I was just checking to see if you guys have became better people since I was left. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, is this thing gonna glitch or what? Hey, guys, what's going on? Whoa. Okay, yeah, that thing is really glitchy. I see what you guys mean. All right, let me just grab my tools and I'll get started immediately. Oh, please just fix this thing. I think this should be it. Well, wait, that's it? You barely even did anything. I mean, yeah, it just had really minor damage. It only fell down the stairs, so, you know, it was gonna have some glitching. Anyways, now the back is screwed in. Let's see if this thing works now. Uh, see if what works now? <gasps> Matthew, you're back! Uh, I mean, you're, you're kinda back. You're back as a toy, at least, and you're not glitching anymore. Whew, man, I feel so much better now. All oh, that guilt I was carrying. But it seems like it's finally over. Uh, uh so why exactly do you have this random copy of Spider-Man here?
Bowser, do not ask that question. Oh, you want to know why I have a copy of Spider-Man 2 for the PlayStation 2 with me at all times? Well, it all started when I was seven years old. Get out of here! You already did your job! Get out! We don't need you anymore. Well, okay then, jeez. I'll just, I'll, I'll just take my tools and my, my, my copy of Spider-Man. Uh, you guys are me! <laughs> well, jeez, what's wrong with him? You know, I don't know, Bowser. I asked that same exact question. Well, apparently now that I'm functioning again, it's been a really weird experience as a toy. I mean, can I tell you guys about something that Luigi did? What? What are you talking about, Mario? Well, wait, Luigi, you did something with him? Uh, no, no, I don't know what he's talking about. He must be lying. I don't think I'm lying. I think I fully witnessed that where you grabbed me and a toy of Peach and he just started <laughs> breaking up. <laughs> Is it done? Oh, thank goodness, taking the batteries out worked! Oh, man, I really dodged the bullet there, didn't I? W what? You guys know I didn't do anything. What is this? Are they serious? Jeez, man, yo, what is it? This, Luigi, what is this? Oh, they're making a third Sonic movie, huh? Those movies are working out really well for them, huh? Uh, yeah, that's the exact issue, Luigi. Why does Sonic have three movies and I don't have any? What do you mean, Mario? You do have a movie. It's coming out pretty soon. And if anything, it seems like people really like it. So at least you're getting a good movie. You might even get three like Sonic. That doesn't matter, Luigi. Why did Sonic get the opportunity first? I mean, what did I do wrong? I mean, to be fair, you don't really have the best track record when it comes to that stuff. What do you mean? What did I do wrong? <laughs> Okay, I see your point, but I still don't get why Sonic had to get the opportunity first. I mean, it's not like he has the most squeaky clean reputation either. I mean, yeah, but what's sitting here complaining about it gonna do? I mean, you can't change the past. It already happened. You just have to move forward with your life. Oh, no, Luigi. I'm not letting this go until I get my justice. I have to confront Sonic. <gasps> Did somebody say Sonic? Oh, I'm so hungry. Are we going to Sonic? Oh, I wish, Junior. Instead, we're talking about that blue ego-filled gremlin. Who does he think he is? What? <gasps> oh, you're talking about Sonic the person oh yeah that guy is so cool we've been talking on the phone all the time recently <laughs> you've been talking to sonic luigi get him out of here he's a spy oh chill out Mario. he's a kid he's too stupid to be a spy anyways junior you think you can get Mario on the phone with sonic he kind of won't let go of his issues with him i mean yeah sure i guess we could do that his phone number is eight one okay guys it's ringing all right i finally get to confront sonic about all this Oh man, guys, I'm so excited for the Sonic Movie 3. I wonder what it's gonna be about. I mean, Shadow was at the end of the last movie. Well, we all know the most important part is just seeing me in it again. <laughs> Come on, man. You know the most important part is gonna be me. Huh? Uh, hold on, guys. My phone is ringing. <sighs> hello? Uh, hello? Is this Sonic? Oh, please tell me I got the right number. Uh, who is this? Because if I know you, I don't have your number in my phone. Uh, yeah, we don't have each other's numbers in our phones. It's me, Mario. I was calling to see if I could ask you a couple questions. Mario? You don't sound like Mario. Who actually is this? Well, what do you mean? It's me! W wait a minute. You don't really sound much like Sonic either. Are you sure this is really Sonic? Yeah, it's Sonic. If this really is Mario, then how did you get my number? <laughs> I might have a couple connections. Anyways, why do you have three movies and I only have one? This is just favoritism, man. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with me? What do you mean, what's wrong with me? It's not my fault they prefer me over you for a movie. But I still don't get how they're making three movies out of you. I mean, how is that even possible? You're so boring. Like, what is actually interesting about you? Uh, I'm the fastest thing in the world. Who wouldn't want to watch a movie about me? Uh, the Flash, Roadrunner, you kind of got a lot of competition, man. Oh, and you think you're any better? You really think people want to watch a whole movie about a middle-aged man who sounds like Mickey Mouse? Oh, so that's how you want to play this? Okay, two can play at that game. Uh, uh. Wait a minute, I forgot this is a phone call. Okay, we need to settle this in person, Sonic. Where are you at? Uh, do you want my address or something? Because I'm not scared of you. Not a problem with me. Let's bring it. Okay, I'll text you the address. See you, red boy. R red boy? What's that supposed to mean? Oh, he texted me the address. All right, let's see. What? What the heck is Sonic doing halfway across the country? Uh, what do you mean, Mario? I mean that there's no way that's his address, Junior. The address he just texted me is, like, literally across the country. We're gonna have to fly a plane to see him. Yeah, see, we should probably stop things now since the beef is getting kind of expensive. Oh, I don't care about that. If that's what I have to do to prove myself, then so be it. M Mario, you can't be serious. Just count your losses and move on, man. We're not about to fly over to Sonic's place. Wait, how did he move so fast? I just saw him a couple months ago. Oh, yeah, I forgot he's the fastest thing in the world, so that was probably easy for him. Well, once we're all over there, he'll realize that he's not safe from us forever. Being the fastest thing in the world comes with a price, and we're about to prove it to him. 
Dude, he's literally had beef with this guy for like 31 years. It's just a soap opera at this point. Yeah, you're right about that, but I don't really have anything else to do, so let's go see Sonic. <laughs> Well, guys, here we are. We're at Sonic's house. Pfft, no surprise he has a smaller house than us. Uh, Madio, are you sure we should be here? I mean, I don't want you going crazy on Sonic if you're that mad at him. No, don't worry, Luigi. Nothing's gonna happen. I'm just coming over to see why Sonic ruined my life. <sighs> the houses are scary. <sighs> Well, here's Sonic's door. So, are you gonna knock or what? Yeah, don't be a scaredy cat. Just confront him already. <sighs> okay. Hey, who's at the door? Whoa, whoa, whoa. How'd you open the door so fast? Uh, because I'm Sonic? Obviously, I can get to the door at the speed of light. Hey, that was pretty cool. You're pretty cool, Sonic. Hey, do you remember me? Uh, no. Who are you? I've never seen you. What? How do you not remember me? Maybe because you only met him, like, once, so he doesn't really have a reason to remember you. Or because he's an idiot. Sonic, can I come in? I need to talk about some things with you. Why did you ask to come in and then walk in anyway? Uh, anyway, uh, come on in, guys. Okay, hey, I kind of like this Sonic guy. He's nice. Yeah, I don't see why Mario has an issue with him. So, you think you're better than me? You think you're better than me? No, you think you're better than me? No, you think you're better than me? Well, where are we going with this? I'm better than you. No, I am. So, uh, what do you think of the theory of quantum mechanics? Dude, I don't even know where my hat is. <gasps> oh my gosh, my prized possession. <sighs> So, uh, what are you even supposed to be? Uh, I think I'm supposed to be like a turtle or dragon? I've never really been able to figure it out, but what are you supposed to be? Oh, I'm an echidna. I can glide and climb walls. Uh, that kind of sounds more like a spider to me. Your head even kind of looks like one. Maybe I've been lying to myself this whole time. Maybe I am a spider. Well, I'm red. Well, I'm blue. Well, red is a primary color. So is blue, dummy. Well, I have all three primary colors on me. So do I. You're not special. Well, uh, at least I'm a person. What does that have to do with anything? Well, you know, I'm just, I, I, I'm better, you know? I have powers. <laughs> so do I, man. I, I have super speed. I'm so much better. Well, I have, like, fire. They, I, I, I can get my own power-ups. I have way more power-ups than you. Trust me. Who cares? My power-ups are better. Well, okay, okay. Guys, guys. Split it up, okay? There's no way that we came over here just to argue. Madio, what did you actually come over here for again? Well, I came over here to prove myself against Sonic! Oh yeah, and I also came over here for that punch. Ow! <sighs> so you think you can punch? Knuckles, go! D dude I don't even know what's going on. Like, who are these people? I mean, that can't be Mario. He looks nothing like him. Well, what do you mean I look nothing like Mario? I am Mario! Oh my god, no wonder you're friends with Sonic. You're so blind and stupid. Hey, you don't talk about my friends like that! Okay, that's it, buddy! <laughs> Get over here, Sonic! Uh, you guys are such animals. Exactly! There's gotta be a way better way to resolve this! Guys, stop fighting! <sighs> okay, wise guy, what's your suggestion for me to beat him to a blue pole? Well, how about instead of physical violence, we resort to challenges instead? That's a lot more legal and fun. Challenges? What kind of challenges? <laughs> it could be anything, but I just think it'd be a lot better of a way to tell who's better at certain things. Wait, haven't we done this before, though? Shut up, Junior! Yeah, this is why nobody loves you, Junior. Yeah, this is why you're lonely, Junior. Yeah, this is why you don't have a mom, Junior. Yeah, this is why your family tree is just a stick, Junior. What? Anyways, yeah, Mario and Sonic will compete in challenges to see who is more skilled at certain tasks. I mean, I guess that could work, but... Do we really have to? I mean, we already all know who's better. Oh, is that so? Madio, Ma Madio, stop. Okay, so what are we doing first? Hmm, well... The first challenge we're gonna be doing is seeing who's better at video games. Well, considering I am a video game character, I'm obviously gonna win this. You realize what you just said, right? We're both video game characters. Yeah, that's kind of why I picked this challenge. So, what game do you guys want to play? <gasps> oh, let's play Mario Kart! I love Mario Kart! Oh, what? I've never played Mario Kart. How is that fair? Hmm, sucks to suck, I guess. You're better at video games, right? Yeah, but... Not the specific one. Fine, we can do it. Yes! Alright, let's get Mario Kart open. There, I'm gonna choose Mario. Uh, wait, where am I? They have Link in this game? They have Splatoon? Well, where am I? Well, you're gonna have to choose quickly, Sonic! Well, who am I supposed to be? I guess I'll just choose this blue Yoshi. It's close enough. Alright, sounds good. It's racing time. All right, three, t t two, one, go! Oh, 
my, yeah, I got a red shell. What? How did you get that in first? That's impossible. This sucks to suck, I told you. Ah, oh. oh, look at me. I'm flying all through the air. Oh, man, no fear. Don't worry, Sonic. You'll be there soon. Uh, Sonic, you, you kind of suck at this. What? Tails, you haven't played this game either. I wouldn't talk. Oh, check me out, Mario. I'm flying too. Uh, it's not that impressive. I was there earlier. <laughs> Mario, you really missed that item box? They were right there. You went right through them. Oh, Sonic, you have a lot more issues than that. I wouldn't be talking. Oh, well, uh, I have a couple of these super mushrooms, so th they'll help me, right? Whoa! Oh my god, I got first place, Sonic! Beat that! Oh, dang it. Well, uh, at least I have this bullet bill, so I, I won't lose too badly. Oh man, I got six. But it's not the worst, though. At least I didn't get 12. Yeah, but what matters is who won, though. It was me! Dude, what did you expect? It's Mario Kart, and you're Mario. Uh, sounds like excuses to me, man. Well, since Mario appears to be the winner, we can move on to the next challenge, which is... The next challenge is the jump challenge. How high of a jump can you survive? Well, how high of a jump? You're telling me this is only the second challenge you're already trying to kill me? Wussy, scaredy cat, told you you couldn't do it. Jing, you didn't tell me that, and I doubt you would do this either. Oh, what's the worst that could happen? I mean, you could fall down there, or, like, break both your legs, maybe get paralyzed from the neck down, live in a chair for the rest of your life. Well, but, you know, that's just life. I'm not too worried about this. I mean, it is kind of a long way down, but nothing too crazy. Okay, Madio, you go first in three, two, one, go, jump down! What? Me first? Oh, man, tough fall. So, is it my turn, Luigi? Uh, I get the feeling I'm gonna get arrested after this, but yeah, yeah, it's your turn, Sonic. You go in three, two, one. All right, go, Sonic. Here we go. <sighs> How was the landing, Mario? Uh, Luigi, you're not my brother anymore. Nah, you'll get over it. Why didn't you just land on your feet like Sonic? You really think it's that easy, Junior? Hey, now that I think about it, how did Sonic win? I mean, he has really stubby legs. Shouldn't they have been, like, really fragile or something? Man, I'm used to falls like these. This is just a classic example of a skill issue. Yeah, you tell him, Sonic. W wait, if Sonic won, then why do they call Mario Jumpman? I mean, he clearly sucks at jumping. Ugh, what's with all this Mario slander? And again, I don't know what I expect to come into Sonic's house. Anyways, it's time for the third challenge, which is... The cold challenge. How long can you survive in the freezing cold fridge? Oh, this should be easy. I mean, since I couldn't really survive the heat wave, then I clearly must be like cold-blooded or something, so this will be perfect. Well, I'm kind of the opposite. I can't stand the cold. Well, that's too bad. You're gonna have to get in the fridge. I even cleared out a space for you. Well, uh, I guess this is our new home for a while. Oh, what's the problem? Are you freezing up already? Woo! Oh, man, this area is pretty spacious. Oh, oh, why is it so cold in here? Okay, now it's not as spacious. <laughs> All right, have fun, guys. So, how are you holding up, Sonic? I mean, it's only been like a couple seconds, so it can't be that bad. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm never going to get out of here. I'm going to... Die in here. Oh, please. Everyone here is so dramatic. Oh, man. It's so funny finally seeing what makes you crack. Oh, you finally broke that ego of yours, haven't you, Sonic? Oh, man. But I do have to say, it is kind of boring in here. And I'm getting kind of thirsty. Hey, Sonic, can you pass me one of those waters over there? One of those... What? <laughs> no. No! No! I'm finally free! The water demons can't get me now! Uh, Sonic, are you okay? Man, I could have lasted like two more seconds in there. Sonic's such a wimp. Wow, what a nut. Anyways, Luigi, so do I win this? Mm, yeah, I mean, it's kind of obvious. Sonic just had his little meltdown there. So, yeah, you win, Mario. Anyways, time for the next challenge. <laughs> The next challenge is a team challenge. Team Mario versus Team Sonic. Who can get more points at Dave and Buster? Piece of cake. I come here all the time. Uh, I'm more of a Chuck E. Cheese guy, but there's still arcade games, so this will be easy. Okay, then. Let's go have some fun. And also see who gets more points, because that's more important. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Let's kick some alien scum. All right, let's do this. Let's grab my gun. Oh, man, this thing is pretty high tech. Oh my god, shoot the alien! Yeah! 
Okay. Okay, I gotta find more aliens. Oh my god, wait, get off me, get off me! You can't take my health away from me. No, you can't! Get all these aliens! Yeah! Oh, well, they keep getting at me, though. I could probably be pretty good at this one. Alright, let me scan this thing. Alright, here we go. Okay, come on. Here we go. go. Okay, uh, I missed one. That's, that's fine. Come on, let's try again. No. Come on, come on. Look. There we go. Alright, awesome. We're doing fine. Two at a time. No, nope. okay, okay. This is this will be one. Oh, nope, never mind. Oh, come on, come on. I'm running out of balls. Man, why can't I get any of these? I got another one. Okay. Zero balls left, three total cups. Oh, well, it's better than nothing. Oh, man. I haven't played dodgeball since the war. But I guess I have to make a comeback somehow. All right, Luigi, let's go. Let's play some dodgeball. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's play dodgeball. Wait, who am I supposed to be hitting exactly? Uh, I'm gonna try to hit that yellow guy there. Okay, let's just... Uh, oh, man, really? I'm gonna try to hit the bonus hit. Okay, uh, okay, it just keeps moving all the time. Uh, hit the yellow? Oh, no. Okay, come on, get the bonus hit. Get... What? Uh, did I win? Oh, I got 10... I, I got 10 tickets and 2,000 points. Huh, I actually didn't do that bad. All right, time to play some pac here we go. Two and one, let's go. The ghosts are catching up. How did this happen? Okay, let's see how good I'd be at being an axe murderer. I probably shouldn't say that out loud, but oh well. All right, let's play this game. All right, there we go. All right, let's play. All right, here are my axes. Okay, so I'm gonna throw these. All right, so let's just throw this one. Am I? Am I did I do it right? Okay. Can I throw another one? Am I? Am I doing it? Am I supposed to like get it right on the target? Okay, I'm assuming I'm doing it right. Okay, that is definitely not how you play it. Okay. Okay, two more. Two more. Okay. And final one. Okay. Did I do it? I I don't know how I'm doing. I guess I I must have done okay. I mean, I got 60. That's is that good? Uh, let me give this claw machine a try. Oh, there's so many cool prizes in here. Oh, what about that black ball? It's right on the edge, so it should be pretty easy. Uh, alright, here we go. Oh, oh, oh my god, I actually won one! Uh, uh, well, uh, okay, it's kind of hard to get out, but I can't believe I actually got that. I can't wait to rub this in Mario's face. Hey Mario, guess what? Look, psst, Mario. What? Check this out. What's in my hand? <sighs> your prize ball. Yep, the prize that I won. So where's yours? Well, I didn't play the claw machine. That's why I don't have one. But if I did, I probably would have won. Oh, excuses, excuses. The claw machine was there the whole time. You just chose not to play because you knew you wouldn't win. <sighs> Whatever, dude. Come on, look, look, check it out. It's right here. My prize that I won. Look at it. Whoa! <laughs> Wait, what? So, it's a fight you want, huh? No, 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 no fights, guys, come on! Luigi, Luigi, just let this play out. This could be kind of fun. Wait. Oh, no. Bald! 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 My uh, all right, all right, enough of that guy. Oh my god. Ooh. One. Wait, I didn't think this could be used as a weapon. Why'd you think I chose it? I knew it would destroy your puny face. And that it did. Oh my god. So. You really want to try and take me on again? <laughs> no, 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 preferably not. <coughs> that was totally wicked! Yeah, but that wasn't really supposed to happen, though. Are you okay, Matteo? I don't know. 
Uh, okay, well, I guess we're gonna move on to the next challenge then, because that wasn't one of them. Get us out of here. Okay, anyways, time for the next challenge. The next challenge is the cooking challenge. Who can make the better sub sandwich? But what kind of determinator is this, Luigi? Most people don't care about somebody's cooking skills, and I don't even remember how to cook anyway. You don't remember how to cook? I've never cooked in my life. Well, to be honest, I kind of made up this challenge because I was hungry. Look, I didn't eat lunch on the way here, okay? You told me you were full after you ate those pretzels on the plane. What happened to that? Oh, I didn't eat those. I just threw them at the crying baby in the third aisle to see if it would shut him up. Hey, my man, I would have done the same thing. Except I probably would have thrown like an anvil at him or something. Anyways, the rules are... Well, wait, there are no rules. You can use whatever ingredients you want. And whichever one tastes better in the end will prove who's the better cook. So, three, two, one, go! Make a sandwich! Whoa! Uh, okay! Whoa, gotta go fast! <laughs> I need to get some ingredients! Why? Wait, wait, my sandwich is more important. Alright, let's see. What do I want to get first? Uh, ooh, Captain Crunch! I'll take this. Uh, okay, what do I want to get for my sandwich? Let's see. I don't really see any proper sandwich ingredients in here. <gasps> Ooh, Oreos! Oh, well, I do love Oreos, so I'm sure they make a pretty good sandwich. I mean, it is kind of like a sandwich, you know, there's stuff in the middle. I, I can use this. <sighs> okay, I'll make a better sandwich. Oh my god, it's hard to look at so good so far. Oh man, this is going great. This looks perfect. It's gonna be so much better than Mario's. <sighs> oh man, I think I need more ingredients. Oh, yes, same here. <sighs> okay, I'm finally done. Oh, Luigi's gonna love this. And there we go. Same here, Mario. I just finished mine. So, where's Luigi? Right here, guys. So, let's see your sandwich. What did you guys make? Well, what's wrong with mine, Luigi? I made a triple Oreo, uh, quadruple cheese it cosmic brownie surprise sub sandwich. Yeah, and I made a... Uh, I don't actually know how to explain this one. Uh, I don't really want to try either of these, so I'm just gonna give Mario the win on this one since I like chocolate. Oh, come on! You haven't even tried it yet! How do you know if it's a interesting masterpiece? Wait, Mario's cheating! He probably did that on purpose because he knows Luigi likes chocolate. I mean, it's not really that hard to please an idiot, so I don't really know what you're getting mad at me for. <laughs> okay, now that I'm back from the bathroom after barfing at the mere sight of these disasters, it's time for the next challenge! The next challenge is going to be a roast battle! Who can roast each other the hardest? Well, obviously I'll roast Mario better. He can't even survive a heat wave. <sighs> not that kind of roasting sonic look all that arguing that you and Mario were doing earlier but it's in a more organized format okay so are you guys ready to roast each other oh so we're just insulting each other then okay that's easy i got a lot up my sleeve yeah i got a lot up my sleeve too okay then this shouldn't be a challenge for you okay three two one go well if we're gonna start this roast battle then the first thing we have to address is sonic shoes i mean like what are those things you really think any girls want to pull you with that hey at least my shoes look cool I mean, what are you wearing? Uh, they're completely unbranded. I mean, you're just wearing these little Goombas on your feet. Oh, yeah? Well, at least I'm not blue. Junior, you're not even in this. Uh, oh, okay, sorry. Well, at least I'm actually respectful of people, unlike you walking around with no clothes all day. Be honest, how many violations of public indecency do you get on the daily? Well, hey, at least I don't wear weird hillbilly clothes that look like I just pulled them out of the sewer five minutes ago. Oh, they're getting close. Fight, 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 fight. Yeah, Mario, go at him. Fight him already. <sighs> no, no, we're not fighting, guys. But you have one more shot, okay? Whoever gets this last roast wins. You shut up. That's why your shoes raggedy. That's why your mama dead. Dead as hell. What shoes she got on? What shoes she had on her casket? That's why your granny ain't got no knees. She can't pray to Jesus, bitch. <sighs> okay, everyone. Welcome to the, the Mario versus the, the Sonic race. Uh, uh, Lakitu? What happened to you? Why do you look like that? Oh, uh, I got in a, a car accident and, oh man, my, my, my bowels aren't doing that well. What does that have to do with anything? Anyways, Mario and Sonic will be racing to the finish line over there. So, are you guys ready? M Mario, are you sure you want to do a race with Sonic? I mean, he's really fast. <gasps> well, wait a minute. Th that is true, Junior. Well, hey, why am I having a race with Sonic? That's not fair. Uh, well, what you think is fair is not, um, uh, fair is a quality of, 
Um, okay, are you guys ready or not? Oh, please. I could beat him any day. You really think this is a challenge? Well, okay, if you're so ready. Oh, no. What do I do? Oh my gosh! I think it worked! I actually got a head start! Oh my god! Oh my god, this is actually possible now! Uh, I'm gonna get out of here. Yeah, same here. I'm not being here when the cops show up. Don't press charges on me! Oh my god, Sonic, are you okay? What did he do to you? Why aren't you moving? Uh, well, why don't you see for yourself? <gasps> Sonic! He broke your leg? We need to get you to a hospital now. N no, uh, we don't have to do that. I just have to win this race. That's all that matters, that I beat Mario. Uh, you can't win a race with a broken leg. You might have to forfeit just this one. Wait, 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 wait. Sonic might be onto something. I've got an idea. What's that? <laughs> what do we do? Perfect! Tails, get in! But, but, Knuckles, this isn't even our car! Finders keepers, man! Do you want Sonic to win or not? No, come on, get in! <sighs> okay, we gotta hurry to that finish line, or else Mario's gonna really beat him. We don't want that to happen. Sounds like a plan. Alright, get back there, Sonic. Uh, uh, don't worry, buddy. We'll get you there. Alright, Knuckles, go! Sounds good! Uh. Alright, let's go, Sonic! Oh man, oh, I'm kind of working up a sweat here. Oh, racing sure is tiring. Oh man, but I can't stop now. I have to beat Sonic. But what am I talking about? I'm already gonna beat Sonic. Oh man, he is so screwed. Okay, almost there. How you doing back there, Sonic? Oh, I can't feel my leg. It's like it's broken. Because it is! Curse you, Mario! Knuckles, keep your eyes on the road! Oh, oh uh, my bad. I, I was just checking to make sure Sonic was still alive. Is this still alive? Okay, I think this is the place. Come on, Tails, get Sonic! Right! Alright. Come here, Sonic. <laughs> okay, there you go, Sonic. You won the race. Kinda. <laughs> okay, Mario, you're almost at the finish line. Oh, you've done good, Mario. You've done good. Wait, what? Oh, they're already at the finish line. Uh, no fair. I thought I broke his leg. How could he even get to the end? <laughs> huh? Oh, and here comes Mario. See, Sonic? I told you you won. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so how in the world did you get here? I broke your leg for a reason. Dude, not cool. You totally cheated. Yeah, I can't believe you'd stoop that low to find alternate methods to win. Well, so then how did you guys get here? Oh, we drove. What, drove? Like you drove a car here? Yeah, that was pretty much our only option. I'm gonna be in bed for weeks after this. Well, at least I actually ran from start to finish. Well, at least we didn't sabotage the competition. Well, at least I didn't... Okay, you know what? Who do you guys think won? You think Team Mario won or Team Sonic? Comment your answer below. But, uh, obviously it's me. I mean, check out my battle scar. No, obviously I'm the one that won. You should already know this was 